surveillance cams. <sighs> Adios, Night City. Should be back in the homeland by 2 a.m.? Yeah. What about you? Get your ticket out yet? I hear the government's sealing a deal. I told you. You're the president's favorite. Are you gonna walk out of this on a red carpet? Yeah, sure. Hey, you deserve it. I wouldn't be alive if it wasn't for you. You know what I'm thinking about right now? Tell me. Taco stand back home. First thing I'm gonna do when I get off this train is head right there. I swear those quesadillas come to me in my dreams. Place sure sounds tasty. Ah, uh, yeah. You were the one that took me there in the first place? Yeah, yeah, I, I remember now. Well, listen, when this is all over, you gotta take a break, you hear me? President. Pill? It's going to be a long flight. No, thank you. I wouldn't be alive if it wasn't for you. V? Can you hear me? and clear, whoever you are. Good, it worked. My name is Somi. Just call me Songwood, though. I know who you are. Know your situation, your problem. And I can save your life. How oh, very funny. Is this a prank? Not in the mood, if so. It's anything but. You must have questions, and I'll answer them in due course shortly. But first, I need you to get to that swollen appendix of Night City called Dogtown. No man's zone where you shoot first, ask questions later. That Dogtown? What? The chance to live to a ripe old age not reason enough to go? Putting it plainly? You know me. I don't know you. But I'm supposed to haul ass to Night City's worst district. Not exactly bursting with excitement about this plan. I'll explain everything and prove I can help you. Right now, though, I'm begging you, V. Dogtown's main gate. Be there as soon as you can. I'll make contact again then. <sighs> this is one elaborate haze. Or a fucking lifeline. What you got in the back? The usual implant boxes, Zeta Tech. Fuck 
can do it! Someone shoved my head in the place! Oh. You're gonna be okay. Breathe deep. Count to ten. Recite a mantra. Whatever brings calm, helps you stabilize. Your nervous system took a big hit. Broke down. Racing heart, cold sweat. It'll pass. What the fuck you doing? This a trap? Opposite. It's a helping hand. Right. I know about the bomb ticking in your head. If I could disarm it now, I would in a heartbeat. You'll feel better any second now. V something stinks here. Think she's she's fucking with the relic. How in the All true, Johnny. But don't you fret. The bolt's safe. Nah, fuck Both off. Both of us on the biochip protocol at once can trigger shots for V. Like you just saw now. Gotta cut you off. What? For your safety, uh, for V's safety. Uh, uh, Had to meet him for now. He hears you fine. Just can't talk back. You a construct? Like Johnny? No, V. I'm a netrunner. Hopped on the Relic's cognitive protocol to dial in. I see and hear what you do. Just now, I am on board Space Force One, sitting right across from Rosalind Myers, President of the New United States of America. The President? Fuck. I... No, you're not joking. Dead serious, yes. The plane's been hacked. Trajectory set for Night City. They'll bring us down to Dogtown soon. Our comms are down, most likely jammed. The Relic was my only option. Right now, you're our one contact on the ground. Plane got hacked, right? You're a runner. Can't override? I could. All I need is 24 hours, the right setup, and a bottomless pot of coffee. None of that's available just now. Telling me the in-U.S. president, Rosalind Myers, is there with you? Sitting right across from me. She knows the situation. Waiting for your yes. How do I help? And how much time we got? Too little to avoid landing in Dogtown. Likely enough to minimize losses, save some folks. That's where you come in, V. The president's life, her safety, that's your top priority. She'll survive the landing. Dogtown, not so sure. You'll need to get her out of the plane before anyone else does. Anyone else? Specifically? Meaning you expect in company? Kurt Hansen, Dogtown's commander in chief. Man's got a thousand and one reasons to want Myers as a hostage. He couldn't have net jacked the plane on his own, meaning Washington's got a mole problem. That one only saw him later. Said you could help me. That the plain truth? Just got a taste of my abilities, I believe. There's more. I can cure you. Once and for all. Can't know how much I'd really love to believe you, but... I know, V. You've hit a dead end. Nowhere to turn. Been there. Believe me. Consider this, uh... An advance. Your relic's crowded with clusters of corrupted data. I'm done with that. Making room for stuff that'll actually be handy. Yes. Some pre militech combat stuff. It's just lying around, gathering dust. I feel it tingling in my fingertips. Kinda nice, actually. Oh, it goes a lot further than tingling, trust me. Now listen, what I gave you is the skeleton soft, but the firmware's fancy. It'll learn, grow with you. It'll improve if you feed it data. Combat analyses. Logs of legendary ops. Shit that make the NCPD piss its boots. Look around Dogtown. Gotta get there first. 
Main entrance is a no-go. If you don't have an entry pass, and I don't have time to produce a fake. You'll slip in the back way, quiet as you can. You really don't need anyone spotting you, scanning you. Guess so. After you. Garage. There, past the fence. See it? Smugglers used to use it. Now it's your turn. Try to sneak in. Maybe distract the guards. I don't know. Something. you go. Look for a net access point. Jack in that, and I'll be able to help you. You should be one level lower. Eyes peeled. Look for a way down. Now, look for a maintenance room. Bet anything you'll find a power source inside. Nice V. Exactly what we need. Okay, we're up. Perfect. Bridging systems now. Hmm. Ancient. No, proto ancient protocols. Largely corrupted data. Give me a sec. Need to ping one of our sats. Let's see which active Dogtown network links to this infrastructure. And putting in a back door. Ready to roll. Hop on the platform. I'll guide you to the garage from there. Hang <laughs> on. Okay, Relic Act first, then you slap the muzzle on Johnny, and now you bring some pile of scrap metal back to life. Serious trickery. Oh, who taught you? I'm an NUS intelligence analyst, trained by the best peeps in the biz. And they took me on because around age 13, I got the local ripper to sell me a beat-up old deck. Barely left him in since. I got noticed, but the rest is history. I got a feeling stories incomplete. Likely longer, more twisted. I think. Apologize up front for the quarry, but I gotta ask. Compeki Plaza Heist. Why? Had a friend. We worked together. Gig was important to him. And he... He was important to you. He didn't make it. What the... You alive? Think so. You need to hang tight for a sec. By the way, must have gotten old by now. Hauling a faded rocker boy around. It strikes me as tiring. Not a silver hand fan, are you? Please. Samurai was done by their second album. Oh, shit! V? President Myers wishes you the best of luck. Nice. Uh, tell Madam President I said, uh, hey. He got it. I laid out the details of our plan. Typical Rosalind. Keep me apprised, she says calmly. Just sitting there, sipping her gin, looking through her agenda, postponing meats. Woman's unshakable. Metro, huh? Reminds me of when I was starting out. I'd look for places like this. Set up a power bypass, jack in, 
essentially steal my way onto the net. Grab the riskiest gigs I could find. Learn them as I went. The hard way, usually. But sometimes, a few times, I really pulled off coups. Anything I'd find on BBS gossip feeds. Hmm. Biotechnica in 63 or 4. Fermentation facility in Oregon. Sound familiar? Hmm. Elevator. Hop in. I'll do the rest. You'll be in Dogtown in a minute. Try to steer clear of Hanson's goons. Speaking of Kurt Hansen, what else do you know about him? Hansen was an officer. Militech. Tail end of the Unification War, his unit was tasked with taking Night City. They managed to secure a foothold in the southmost pocket and stuck around. Refused to demobilize, lay down their weapons, found in Dogtown instead. Traded one conflict for another, basically. Hot or cold, no better way to make a buck than war. the stairs through storage. You should pop into the market. Get your ammo, assault rifles, tactical gear. Hmm, to tame? I'm scared what we got in the back. V, um, been meaning to ask. How bad is it for you? What's it look like? Here I am doing some mystery runner's bidding, chasing down the NUS Prez in NC's meanest corner. All oh, because I caught a whiff of hope. And I know, it means I'm either crazy or desperate, right? Wrong, V. It means you have the guts to keep going. It's hard, I sense that. But you're fighting, in spite of it all. Nice to hear. Hope you're right. Chin up. We're in this together. There is that. All right. Time you got up on the roof. The hell for? For the view. And I'm not being coy here. I mean, you'll see where we land, literally. Circuit. I've lost access. What now? Try and restart the generator. Hmm. <sighs> problem after problem. You keep breaking shit. Tech keeps tottering on its last feeble legs. Or you hack rough and the hardware don't like it. Finally, pop in. Elevator's roofbound. <laughs> FYI. We're about to cross into Night City airspace. Might be a bit of a shock. Braced for it. And, uh, whatever comes next. Not sure one can ever be ready for a force landing. In Dogtown, of all places. But having you means my chances are looking up. You made it. Good. How's the sitch on board? Stable, but tension's rising. Unsurprisingly. See that? It's us. Space Force One. We're descending. In for a rough... Oh, fuck. What? What's going on? <laughs> Save the 
president. Sure. No fucking problem. Songbird, thought you might have... Fuck. Yeah, I know, I know. Songbird the cat. Life number nine commenced. Alas. I made sure to get Myers to the safe room before I ejected. Run to the wreckage bay. Save her. Uh. Missiles, Songbird? They just shot you clean out of the sky. No fucking way. I had no idea Hansen was that fucked in the head. We're that fucking determined. You need to hurry. What then? Got a plan? Find Myers, get her to Liz Crestry. It'll be the safest spot in Dogtown right now. Right. I'll be in touch. Godspeed, B. Eleven on board, counting myself and Rosalind. Am I still alive? No idea. Must be some way I could. Wait, I got it. The crane arm. Hop on. I think I can put it up. Not a second to spare now. Across the room, right straight ahead. Ready, steady. Enemy backups on the way. He hit the ground. It's gonna explode. Make for the wreck. Watch it. If I can't let it not going. Tank's insulated. It won't explode. See anything? A whole lot of wrecked aircraft. Anyone alive? Nobody jumping out to greet me. Shit! Are we too late? Pretty quiet in here. Like, too quiet. If that's true, then... I need to be sure. Need confirmation she's dead. Keep moving back. You'll see a safe room. I'll pop the release on the door. Rosalind Myers, you're looking at the solution to your current problems. Name's V. Uh, corny as it sounds. My favorite letter of the alphabet just now. Apologies. I had to be sure it was really you. Right. Let's Delta. <laughs> Damn it! They just won't- 
Don't let up! Bird. You there? V. How's the cinch? We're alive. Both of us. Now listen. Head for the vacant building on... Elizabeth Cress. Got it. <coughs> Give me some credit. It's the best place to lay low. No heat signatures, so it's empty. Not a soul inside. Now get moving. Got Songbird on comms. She's fine. Found us a safe house nearby, too. Songbird. That started to worry. I suppose I forgot she always lands on her feet. That crazy look, both of you. Ah, maybe you brought it with you. This is some fucking nightmare. My people dead. All of them. Because of me. Well, well, Kurt Hansen killed them. Not you! you think you have no idea how deep this goes we were hacked it means Hansen had help from Washington the NUS government is aware of the crash no doubt they'll have sat mapped it seen us hit the ground in Dogtown unless unless the plot goes deeper Hansen spreading his agitprop lies as we speak I'm sure of it our people will have an even harder time crossing the border I just... Fuck! I don't know what to do. Understand your concerns. Don't forget you got me here, though. You? And Songbird. We'll get you out of this mess. Thank you, V. We stick to the plan. After that, well, I guess we'll see. Wait a second. Damn it! If Hansen's got someone inside in Washington, that means I'm traceable. Wherever, whenever. I have a subdermal tracker. It needs to go ASAP. It's near an artery that's best not nicked. I'll need your help. Chipping the prez with the tracker? Weird. Safety precaution. In case I ever wanted to ditch the White House, go on an all-night bender. Can you help? I assume you know what you're doing. Be completely on your own without the tracker. Well, you're here. Okay, so far? <sighs> Don't have a choice. <sighs> Okay, okay. Wait, wait, is that? Drone, finish up, quick. Cover now! That was close. V? I'm here. Right on time. You in one piece? For now. Can't say I'll stay that way. We need to get to the top of the building. Talk later. Got Songbird on comms. Says we gotta climb higher. Lead the way. It's your city, after all. Kurt's hounds have caught your scent. You need to move. Delta time. Let's go. We'll ask our guardian angel if she can get this elevator moving.
Was okay at your end? Where are you operating from? Well, not from a cool, comfy ice bath. God knows what I get for that now. I'm nearby, though. Just had to find a new nest, or they would have found me. Elevator could use a runner's touch, Song. Already on it. Uh huh. Sorry, V. My magic's no good here. What we need's power. There's a maintenance shaft with a fuse box nearby. Follow the scaffolding. Says I need to turn the lights back on. Might take a minute. Fine, I'll keep my head down. Do you think it'll work? Lousy place to get stuck. Just one way to find out. What's the probability a random passerby noticed a moving elevator in an abandoned hotel? <sighs> right. Leave the analytics to Songbird. Little fuckers are fidgety. Sharp sensors on those. If they've sensed us already, the place will be swarming in no time. Great reason to move on and keep moving. My thoughts exactly. And mine. Just stay calm and keep quiet. Hold. Drone on your left. Remote controlled. If I touch it, I give away your position. Something best avoided. Restaurant. Subnet access point in there. If you jack in, I can inject some fake hostile readings. Send the drones chasing after geese. Doable. to do all the work. Now's your chance to slip out. Tip toes the recommend. Area, secure the perimeter. On it. <gasps> Four wheels, two seats. Take her. Multiple patrol six V. Stay on your toes. We have a plan we need to stick to. Elizabeth Crest Street. That's where you need to go. You'll take old metro tunnels. Find the nearest station beneath an abandoned expo hall. Copy that. Brief Myers, can you? We should all be on the same page. Songbird's leading us to a metro tunnel. You can just hear it. I think I know the one. Good move. Exposed to the street. Some bags won't let up. Lose them before access to the garage. Follow the occupation! Even easier to trace and track in a car. Gotta lose them fast. I hope you know what you're doing. What are you doing, B? You can't just leave her behind. Looks clear. Fine. Nice change. Dogtown. What a joke. Did you all nuke this place? 
you all. First time I'm here. Likewise. And if I never make it back, it'll be too soon. Sheesh. Looks like a kind of museum. A museum of wishful thinking. Where the rich bought and sold so many unfulfilled dreams. Uh huh. Seen my fill of gonk magnet ventures like this. Huh. In a past life? What was it? Real estate? Entertainment? Arasaka, actually. Research and development, broadly speaking. Specializing in data acquisition. Quaint name for corporate espionage. Quaint indeed. No need to delay. So quiet, I can hear my crone creak. Quiet's a good sign. I think so. I generally prefer lively places. Feel free to ask her about those exhibits. Really wonder what she'll say. A gilded monument to a certain someone's bloated ego. Damn. There's no way around this? Songbird, got a stitch. Can you jimmy the door? On it. Ugh, the lock jammed. Gotta brute force it, B. Time to roll up your sleeves. No need. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. Head for the elevator, just across the room. Huh. One of Hanson's warehouses, it seems. Gotta find an elevator, other side of the room. This is no time to stop and think. Okay, here goes. V, do you hear that? Shit, bastard's caught up to us again. Songbird? Hey, bad news this time. Hanson's dogs caught your scent. Assault incoming. You probably got spotted outside. Either way, get ready. What now? Got a surprise for our guests. Making the final adjustments now. They won't get me! You can visit for a sec. Need that. Myers, we gotta engage him. Song's on the case. No! Hager! Bird, what's with you? What the hell is going on, V? Dunno, Song's having a fit or something!
move, damn it! There, got it! Elevator on the way! Stay low till it gets here! You're not dying on me today. <sighs> no. <sighs> Guess not. Right. Good. You okay? Injured at all? Nothing serious. I got lucky. <clears throat> Can't stay here. Are you mobile? Teamwork. Have luck. A pile of luck, me. Grab what you can, and let's head out. 
There has to be an exit here, somewhere. Let's try this one. Hmm. What's this? Good stuff. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Dead quiet. Still. Not good. Come on! Fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? V. Let's pause. Think for a sec. What's eating you? I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Okay, gonna give it a shot. I need a songbird. Starting to worry us, girl. Song, are you there? No answer, huh? Guess you got me and only me. Great to see you again, Johnny. Curb the enthusiasm, kid. Never know. Could need me. So? Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. What happened back there? With so me? Something was off for sure. Could say she got hit with a demon. Maybe tripped a defense protocol on the Chimera's ice. Could say. Mm-hmm. If Songbird was a cookie-cutter runner. Both know she's not, though. Damn fucking straight. But who knows? Eh, whole thing was a clusterfuck. You know, knowing that run comes without a burn risk. No. Impossible. Somi's had occasional off moments lately. Temporary slumps. But I'm sure she's headed where we're headed. Same destination she gave us. It's the reasonable thing to do. Right. Reasonable. Girl's gonna have a hell of a hangover. If she wakes up. Unamused. Not the time for jokes, Johnny. Being dead serious. Felt like I was underwater. Leagues down. Tried to surface, but this suffocating, sucking sound pulled me back in. Then when she lost control of the Chimera, the water turned into fucking boiling tar. Seems like the Sitch spiraled out of control. Amen to that. Though actually could have been a straight overload. Seen runners caught in those. Shit's ugly. So, can we move on? southwest now. Feels like we're circling back. Uh-huh. Song mentioned an abandoned building. Place to lie low. No heat sick, so should be relatively safe. I pray you're right, so me. Could use a little help? Of course. Damn fork. Well, we didn't account for this. Which way now? Thoughts? Hmm. Let's try this way. Looks promising. 
Cameras? Here? Satan's balls in here. Should plug that. Look for a valve. There we go. Elizabeth Chris Street. Bullheaded headed Betty. That's what we called her. Re-elected nine times. Believe it? She must have had her ass welded to that seat. Funny how she has her own street in Night City of all places. That jealousy I'm detecting? Please. Jealous of what? V, are you? One sec. It'll pass. <clears throat> <clears throat> See? <clears throat> Better already. What's the matter? Are you hurt? Yeah, I could say that. <clears throat> Old wound. One that literally has you on the floor. Got an... Experimental Arasaka biochip in my brain. It's killing me, literally. Sumi says she might have a solution. Wait. You're talking about the relic. That'd be the one. The secretive tech someone stole from Arasaka. On the day Saburo lost his battle with mortality, no less. Bingo. So that's how she could reach you. That also goes a long way toward explaining the nature of your deal. I appreciate the candor. Seems it's all for one and one for all, if we're to survive. Expect in more trouble? Tonight? I expect nothing but. It's best to be prepared for any contingency. Okay, this is us. Eight. Fucking black. Where are you, Somi? Huh, guess we got here first. Seems so. I'll have to sit tight. Though I assume we'd rather not sit in the dark. Power would be useful. We could also get the radio up and running. What? Can't miss our daily dose of fear mongering? We need to know the situation on the ground. I'm gonna change out of this mess. High time. Change? Into those filthy old rags? These filthy old rags won't be smeared all over every TV and terminal screen in the city. Unlike my presidential best. Have a look around. I'll join you in a minute. Check this, V. Attempted postmodern art. More like a home cooked generator. Maybe we kickstart it, literally? Uh huh. Old Thornton engine, pretty run down. A little bit of chew left, too. If the fuel's not degraded, it could actually run. But can't start it. 
Not without a power source. Sure, but seeing as we got a lull in the lead pouring down on us. Listen, got a bad vibe about this. You? You? Bad vibes? <sighs> Big surprise. Songbird, S-tier netrunner, promises a panaceum, a cure-all, then gets wiped off the map. Myers, shady politico, got a dagger thrown at her back all the way from Washington. Who by and why? Fuck if we know. Oh, plus Kurt Hansen and this fucking Sam launcher. Just preem. Got this hot itchy feeling in my groin, like someone's not fessed up to something. One thing's sure. Plot runs Mariana trench deep. We'll cobble together the full picture, piece by piece if needed. More like rest in pieces, us both. Anyway, let's get this power sitch sorted. All good in there? Yes. I know how to change clothes, V. Just because I haven't had to for 12 years. Should do a trick by my eye. Fire it up. Fingers crossed. Here it goes. And a maze balls. Look what I found. What do you say? There's more in the fridge. Feel free. You earned it. New look. Great. Right? Should draw less attention, too. Grab a gulp. Just earned yourself a vote, Madam President. Are you even registered? Housewarming gift from Songbird, maybe? <sighs> Wouldn't it be wonderful? And circling back to Night City, speculative chatter continues tonight around the downed passenger craft. And U.S. representatives claim President Rosalind Myers was aboard when catastrophe struck. City officials have yet to release any statement. However, one all-too-familiar figure did decide to speak out. Kurt Hansen, the self-proclaimed leader of Dogtown, called a press conference earlier today to offer his take on the situation. I'm being framed. Isn't it obvious? The NUSA's been out for my blood for years. Now I'm not without flaws. But another thing I'm not is suicidal. An attempt on the life of the head of the NUSA? What transpired in Dogtown is no trivial matter. I urge you all to consider the true motives behind this... spectacle. The NUSA will take any excuse it can get to send forces into Dogtown. And will they stop there? <laughs> no. You... Good people of Night City are next in the fucking line. Shit. Mark my Fuck words. This. Troglodyte's clever. Maybe too clever for his own good. Oh, so Hansen's decided to wave a classic false flag. So doubt, reap apprehension towards any in USA attempt to get you back. Both ends fight in the middle. Well, you sure know how to cheer people up. Some mysterious parties out to trigger war. An attempt on my life's a damn good case of spell eye. Gotta let Washington know you're alive ASAP. Ah, call Washington without knowing who'll answer, friend or foe. Or should I go outside? Give Hanson snipers a big thumbs up. No, V. Neither's an option. Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird. Maybe. Can't be sure, though. 
It's our lucky day, Shumba. A penthouse with a view of the city. And lights that work. No. This doesn't feel right. None never does with you, does it? Fucking killjoy. You want an angle on Hanson's airdrops? You got it. V, we need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. Wait. I'll be there. Wanna try talking first? I hope you know what you're doing. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Just looking for a place to hold up for the night. This one's taken, clearly. Told you. Back the hell up! That's better. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Just looking for a place to hold up for the night. This one's taken, clearly. Told you. So I see. This the uh, presidential suite. Shit. Word is, they a bounty on the head of Rosalind Myers. What we gonna do about that? Had a chance to walk away. Should have taken it. Cocky motherfucker. They didn't leave me a choice, whoever they were. It's too few problems down the line. Tough, but necessary. Yes. Yes, you're right. The bodies. We really should do something. I saw a shoot in the hallway. Another problem solved. Don't know about you, but I've about had it with today. Tomorrow will come quickly. I need to rest. Here. What if more like them show up? That shoot's not going anywhere. You serious? Come on. I think I've had my fill of surprises for one day. Still nothing from so me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. So, what if Songbird don't show? We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well... Then... I'll have one other option to consider. But let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. <laughs> Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. Hmm. See you in the morning, V. not here. I mean, she's not coming. You've seen the swarms Hansen has out hunting. I didn't have there. Possibility. One that concerns me the most. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Could it still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Listen, no, we had a calm night, but you gotta leave Dogtown. How? In a car trunk? Fingers crossed? Hansen's waiting for that sort of desperate attempt. Okay, gotta be away. Let me think. <sighs> no, my share of fixers. Bet we could get one to... Out of the question. They'll hand me over to the highest bidder. 
Gotta find her myself, sounds like. On my own. Not entirely. I have just the person to help. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intelligence efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With the conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. Sleeper agent. No shit. Tell me more. Unless it's like a state secret or whatever. It is. Of the false bottom drawer variety. Let's say you want to secure your interests on another country's soil. If diplomacy fails, you resort to other means. Like a military coup? That's one option. Solomon Reed is another sure one. Seven years undercover. Guy sounds like a true asset. Used to be with Arasaka once upon a time. Counter intel. Never saw any Reed on file. Above your pay grade, maybe? Consider that. Maybe I was too busy getting my hands wet and dirty. So, that's a yes. Go back, up your clearance, and check again. Ooh, hard pass. Close chapter in my life. Good. Although Reed is likely to keep it open. Why? War's been over seven years. For some, wars never end. How do I find your guy? Guessing I can't just buzz him on his work hollow, huh? Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. A what now? Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. Mean an, an analog landline? That crashed your open a hole in space-time? When sending sensitive information, you use the technology least vulnerable to interception, old or not. That Caliente should still be wired for it. Owner have a thing for antiques? He had a thing for federal money. And he might still be alive. Remember, 0931. Okay, seems doable. And I prefer discretion to destruction. I trust that's clear. Mm-hmm, so what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the? A file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Telling me I'm a special agent now? That's right. But taking the oath make it feel more real. Secret comms line, presidential token, what's next? A coded message in today's scream sheet? That token is for your safety. If Reed isn't 100% certain I sent you, he won't hesitate to kill you. Seeing as we're on the same side, can't hurt. Oh, V. Repeat after me. I, V, do hereby solemnly swear. I, V, do hereby solemnly swear to faithfully serve the new United States of America. Fucking pathetic. To faithfully serve the new United States of America. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. I pledge to defend my country against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Should this cause claim my life, so be it. Know what? Change my mind. Formalities aren't really my thing. Hmm. Huh. I see. They're half my job, so trust me. I get it. Welcome to the FIA. Good luck out there, V. And don't let the bastard snap you.
Hey, made the right call not taking that fascist ass oath. Oh, yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. How'd you come to that? Because with the biz done, their arm will still be far up your ass and you'll be a meat puppet. No, I was once a corpo jarhead, right? Practically dove into uniform head first. They had a real hard on for the oath. Repeat after me, blondie fucking blah. But can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. Sure you want to talk about this? Gotta hand it to you, V. Wiser than I was back in the day. Huh. That smoke mean Dogtown chose a new pope? Maybe the Veep crashed Space Force too. Curious as I am. We got an important call. V, in Dogtown, are you? Well, I've but one word of advice. Caution. Hands? Sheesh. What's your link to this area? This is Pacifica's bumping, thumping business heart, where the real deals are done. So, we finally gonna meet in person? I can say neither yes nor no. In lieu of an answer, I've new work for you. I hope you'll accept. One last thing. How you breach Dogtown's border, I'm not certain. Though, I suspect not via the main gate. Irrelevant in any case. I've secured clearance for your future convenience. Your name and likeness now registered in the system, granting unfettered passage over the district threshold. Talk again soon. Man, fuck the courts! Shop local! Shop with Ronald Ronnie the Ronster! What do you need, Angel? Hey, Capitan Caliente. Closed? Shut him boarded. I wanna talk shit about Kurt. Mad disrespect. Had no choice. Hanged himself out back. Uh. Oh. Hey, you a fresh face, so listen up. Here in D-Town, you watch what you say. Talk shit to the wrong chew. Blam, you're dead. Anyone inside right now? Don't know, don't care. Buy something or get off my ass. Let's see what you got. Dreamy shit you ever seen. Captain Caliente. Guy clearly went down with this place. Stash house by the looks of it. Right, let's see what's here. Antique. Junky variety. I wonder if it even works. Have a double cheeseburg while you're at it. Uh, anyone there? Hello? Fossil's probably busted. Or you flubbed the number. The fuck do we do now? Who is this? A friend? Andrew Jackson, basketball court. Daytime. 
Not exactly loquacious, our man of mystery. Could just prefer text. Damn sure I do. Seats in the house. Gonna be a game to remember. Johnny Silverhand, basketball fan. That's new. You know what I mean. Another game starting. One where your head's the fucking ball. About the same thing. Something nasty's brewing. Fucking storms, what's brewing? Don't let the sunshine <laughs> fool you. You're up against seasoned players, whereas you just stumbled onto the court. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, her type is all. Politicians. Worse, armed forces. Saying no to high-ranking Cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. The dauntless Johnny Silverhand, scourge of megacorps. Here we go. Vanquisher of hypocrisy. Bolted from the army? Give this man his fucking encore. Gog who enlisted was Robert John Linder. Got roped in with easy cash, promise of fame, glory. Linder snuffed it. Was a different kid who crawled home from the front. Johnny, I... I didn't mean to... It's okay. Was a long time ago. One thing I did learn. Kate in blood and mud. What was that? After every carrot comes the stick. Allow me to illustrate. Every grunt gets a rifle, flak jacket, and a bunch of promises. Comes a time you're out of ammo, Kevlar's tattered cardboard. And what's left of the promises? Fuck all, I'm guessing. Exactly. And that's when they reach for the stick they call values. Getting shelled in your dugout, tombs are taking refreshing phosphorus showers, and some officers ranting about loyalty and duty. The moment you stop shitting carrots and they wave the value stick, fucking run, rabbit. Run. Sounds like you got some shit to work through. Gotta face your demons sometime, Johnny. Didn't actually have a problem with them. Till now. Politicians, military runners, intelligence operatives, and Colonel Hansen for dessert. All the rotten fish in one fucking barrel in this dog town. Don't turn around. Eyes on the court. <laughs> Hans, what you holding? Got this token? Mean anything to you? I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close, this one. Who? Sent you. Rosalind. I don't know any Rosalind. And neither do you. Got a pro spy here, V. Is she safe? Hard to say. No longer we sit here. That's it. Dribble around him. Were you followed? Did you even bother to check? <laughs> Take me for a fucking gonk? An amateur? You sure fooled me. But fine. That I have to do. Black Thought and Merrimack on the street. Three minutes, front seat. Huh. That it? Interrogation over? Already we're starting to have fun. Reese? <sighs> Slippery motherfucker. I think we really hit it off. Sure. Betty's got candy in that van. Ready to find out?
before we go, apologies for the precautions. I only ever rest so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Chun's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. Odd introduction, but nice meeting you too, Reed. Not a phrase I often hear in this trade. You're not in the biz, V. Our biz. Actually, I am, though. Just since yesterday. I was about to say your first time's out are the hardest, but I'm not gonna lie. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. Arisaka Counterintelligence, terminated for undisclosed reasons. Now, a freelance merc, working for the FIA as of last night. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? Songbird hired me. Know her? Show me. Something up? We used to work together. I thought I heard the last about her, but... That girl's a magnet for trouble. Right. It's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. Address, please. Just... FYI... Not so sure you're gonna like it. Try me. Abandoned building on Crest Street, 8th floor. Damn straight I don't like it. You left her alone? In Dogtown? Was I supposed to drag her along while cruising around? Actually... Look, place seemed plenty safe to me. Safe? A derelict building in Dogtown. Just listen to how that sounds. Hold up. I need to take this. Why are you calling me on my day off? Last I heard, you're the manager. Ask Bob, he owes me a favor anyway. Yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without me. Boss man, I work the door at a club. Selection, you know, bouncing. Can think of one thing we have in common. Both got potential we're wasting. Being on Arasaka's payroll is realizing one's potential. Got a grudge? Saka step on your toes that hard? Yeah, they try to off me. Botched it. End of story. You tell me. That makes two things in common. We have company. It's so bright. Damn it, hands is goons! Here we go! You made a big fucking mistake! Did our damnedest to stay off the streets. If so, good idea, poor execution. Here's hoping we're not too late. Fucking prim. Follow close behind. Hanson's kangaroos. Must have spotted you. Tracks you left. We need to take those fools down and hope we're not too late.
it on. Elevator, find cover. Let this bitch up! All of them? Are there yeah, more? Yeah, I, I, I think that's all. Came out of nowhere. They step foot in the building, you hide, you hear me? Let us handle this. Come on, V. This wasn't supposed to happen. Then why Frank's dead, huh? Fuck! Some things never change. What? Wherever she goes, people get hurt. Bodies drop. Oh, shit. Should've wiped those camera recordings. My bad. A mistake. Happens to everyone. Let's hope we can correct it. If anyone had tried to extract her forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would've gone quietly. Open up. It's me. Is this how you greet me? Uh... Sorry. Roslyn, are you all right? I'm good. Glad to see you are, too. Hmm. You remembered my number. Some numbers you never forget. Level with me, Roslyn. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. No, Reed. We need to talk first, all three of us. Here. The President, a merc, and a special agent walk into the Oval Office. Question is, where do I fit into this joke? You've seen the news. Uh-huh. Hansen's spin work never fails to amuse. He's not acting purely on his own initiative. Someone from our camp's propping him up. Hansen, any idea who he's in bed with? Roslyn has more enemies than you can count. This shit runs deeper, Reed. I wasn't alone on that flight. I heard so me was on board. Where is she now? V was the last person to talk to her. Most likely scenario, got caught in some ice on the combat bot when she hacked it. One little mishack happens even to the best, but no way to know for sure. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, we need hard evidence, not speculation. Reed, I needn't remind you what this means for the NUS's national security. Besides, she's your prodigy, Saul. You taught her all your tricks. Hell, even recruited her. She and V have a unique... Uh, bond. It's a lead. Our only one for now. You two have to find her. Together. I already died for the cause once. Not enough? What do you mean you died already? What has my eyes told you about me? Said you'd let an intelligence cell here. Went into hibernation at war's end. So she omitted the fact that Arasaka tried to smoke me. <clears throat> and that I ended up in intensive care with three bullet holes. That six months had passed before I could take a shit on my own. Might have slipped her mind. Convenient. Well, now you know. Let me get this straight. You abandon Reed and NC. Leave him for dead, and now expect him to jump right back into shit? Newsflash, Madam President. Got a hell of a debt to pay. You're right. I'm sorry, Reed. For those seven years. 
Is that enough to get us a fresh start? I'm here. I'll help. But I'm doing it for Somi and my country. Call me naive if you like. As for you, V, you said in the car a songbird hired you, correct? I don't know how much he's paying, but you better ask yourself, is it worth it? Songbird's my only shot at surviving. Got Arasaka's relic in my head. Slowly, surely poaching my brain. Seems we're all on the same page now, V. Which means we can help each other, too. Agreed. Think so, too, Reed. If we want to find Somi, we gotta dig deep. I mean, actual reconnaissance. No stone unturned. We need contacts, informers not afraid to sing, who might see something in it for themselves. You'll need to earn their trust. Yeah, big ask in Dogtown. Won't be easy. I need to arrange a safe passage to Washington for Myers. Expect my call soon, V. Thanks. For everything. You! Do? Come here a minute. Talking to me? Looking at you, ain't I? Come on, we got like a situation. Look, vodka. Have a shot. Hanson gonna hang me by my cojones anyway. So what the hell? Name is Paco. This here's Babs. V. Okay, V. Let's drink to the sitch. Like, toast the mofo and hope he goes away. Here's to drowning our worries. Here's to him drowning and never resurfacing. Bab says I fucked big time, but as I see it, like, no shit too deep, you know? What you think? I mean, in general? In life? Keep your eyes peeled. Well, like, yeah, yeah, in life. It's not always sink or swim. Sometimes you get to ride the wave. Eh, don't know, Chum. Seeing more of a riptide now. So, okay, can I start now? Yeah, what the hell? Weave your tail. Just Paco, begging you. On the down low. Wall's got ears, feel me? Wait, let's do it right. Go for real feels, eh? Take a whiff. It's deep dive. Gonna take you there live. Make you feel part of it. Day was tight as shit. My ticket to the majors, get me? Wanna feel it? Take a big whiff and listen. What is this? Militech cognitive enhancer spike to something? Same kind of inhaler. Be one hell of a ride. How the hell you know shit like this? They'd give it to us in training. Fucking tight! Oh, V. Okay, okay. Settle down to listen. So, picture this. My first day in Hansen's army? Waiting for the boss man, yeah? Legs shaking like jelly. Fuck! No! Imagine you Hanson himself, and you was pissed. You was super pissed, Kurt Hanson himself.
You wish to talk, so said the radio. Do you? Will you sort out the scab deal, or gonna fuck that up too? I don't know what you mean. They'll want to fuck us. We need to be prepared. Clear? Of course it's clear. Come now, this is rookie shit. Rookie shit, like talking to the police commissioner? You were my messenger, Yuri. Now half the NCPD knows about our dealings. Then, dead silence. Cause you know, Yuri and Kurt been in the army together. Militech dropped him here years ago, yeah? And I'm standing there, waiting, lost. I actually shit myself a little. Yeah? Babs is whispering, egging me on like, and I'm thinking, if he don't kill Yuri, he gonna kill me for sure. Do it, Kurt! Little bitch is begging for it! Fuck him up! Bring it, Grunt. What? Best shot, come on! Hit me! Hitting him like that! Telling you, felt like the real deal. And that dog knowed where to hit. Oh, I can still feel it in places. Pup will do. I can tell. I drive him around the block again. And we will. We will. Welcome to the pack, Kira. <laughs> like hell he said that. You'll handle the next convoy. Let's see what you're made of. And I felt like born again, Chum. Blood running down my face. But I'm so happy I'm howling. And? You keeping up? Attention all residents. Oh, strong stuff. Makes me want to lay one on you myself. <laughs> Give it a week, Chumba. Need to heal. Get in the smack and line, V. Ain't the end. Got his mission still coming. So listen, was one of those gigs, you know? Like garden airdrops or transporting? I was protecting our convoy. Feeling a conclusion coming on. Also feeling things gonna turn out fucked. He probably gonna get lynched on a cable. This is how he gonna end. Transport he talking about was for scavs. So shit got heated. Babs loves complaining, but the opportunity looked real, real good. To the end. Hmm. Give me another way for the dive. So we drive in, right? Boss man himself next to me. Suddenly, tires screeching, and I'm thinking, Mierda, esto se sale de madre. Motherfuckers. Fucking awesome, pre-name, and he was out for blood. Rats have blocked the road. <laughs> Buckle up, pup. Time to remind these bastards who in charge. Fuck, he was a machine! Like, precise! And you know, blam, blam, blam! Blasting away, yeah? Slaughtered all of them we did. Metallic smell of blood in the air. Massacre. We have a groaner, still breathing. Sure to tell us something interesting. Dirty fucking rats. At least the kid showed some teeth. Well, not half bad. You got something. Weren't lying about being quick, kiddo. Good work stomping these rats. You will not get away with this! All right. The goods go back to the Sapphire. Just be careful, kid. Yuri and I gotta ask our scav friends some questions. Attention all residents, this is Kurt Hansen. Keep listening, V. 
What this Goncast did next is a story I've been waiting for. Okay, so listen. Before we left, Yuri gave me a list. No power generators there. I look into the truck, and what's there? Generators. Yeah, Yuri probably grabbed some on the side, wanting to hawk him off for a quick eddy after the scav shit show. And this dumbass thought if he snatched and sold him, he'd be set for a year. They're checking to see if he's cool. He straight up robs him. Only idiots say no to opportunity, Babs. So, what'd you do with this opportunity? Uh, well, shit. Sold them to a guy. Said he had a client in India. Probably being shipped. Can wave him adios. Oh, they're gonna kill him, right? Fuck. And me in the bargain? Come on, I see you thinking good. Can you help, sister? Sure, can help you. Advice don't come free, though. Yeah, yeah. We got scratched, Chum. I'd have an idea, yeah. Okay, we frame Yuri. Guy's on Kurt's shit list anyway. We do this right, problem will solve itself. Fine, L let's just please take this convo somewhere else. Uh, uh, underground passageway nearby. Talk there. Tomorrow evening, yeah? Amen to that. Set any contact dates. You know, just in case. Hey, I'm back in town. What's your status? Our special delivery all good. No uh, delays? Shipped. First leg by sea, then by air. Civilian craft both. But it got to its destination fast and undamaged. Any developments here? My status? No real changes, I suppose. The time we got down to work. Gotta find our missing friend. Had another pair of eyes. Alex, former team member. She's in Dogtown, under deep cover. She'll help out. Roger that. Got an address? Longshore Stacks, a dive bar called the Moth. After sundown, yeah? Got it. And senses trained on any potential shadows. If you want my advice, I dump that pile of human offal. See how he likes being alone. Yeah, maybe you're right. Anyway, better get going. Take care. Chin up, sweet kins. Seeing sunshine round the bend. Just don't you let those bastards walk over you. What'll it be, honey pie? Surprise me. Adventurous. How special coming up. AV, hey you at the bar? Sure am. Waiting for you. I'll be there momentarily. There's, uh, one thing you should know. Kay? What did that be? You know that op seven years back that went south? Well, my eyes left me for dead. Cover story was I sold out to Arasaka. I never told Alex it was a cover. So, things could get tense. You and Alex, two of you were close? I let our cell in the NC was her handler. She wound up stuck here in Dogtown post-war. Thinks it was because I turned coat. Do you see what I'm driving at? Mentioning the sooner never entered your mind? Truly, Reed? Damn it. I'm mentioning it now. I'm nearing the entrance. And there you are. Enjoy, honey bunch. Thanks. First time in here. I got that right? You new to Dogtown? Oh, hell no. I'm looking for an Alex. Like fuck you are. So she not here? 
You're on the awfully short list of folks we just don't serve here. Turn the fuck around and get I'll out. I have a gin and tonic. Make it a double. She's with me. You've got some balls. All right, my people. We gotta close up for the day. I ain't going fucking anywhere. Come on. You serious? Everyone out! Now! Alex. Seven! Seven fucking years in this shithole! Cause of you, Solomon Reed! Saul ain't getting it. Maybe you will. Hey, what the hell? Relax, just want to talk this through. President Myers sent us. Got a mission in Dogtown. With him? FYI, seven years ago, this scumbag stabbed everybody no, in the back. seven years ago, I was ordered to go to ground. And you were fed a cover story. I had to take the fall. There was no other way. Expect me to believe you? Just like that? Get the fuck out of my sight, both of you. This look familiar. Got direct orders from the president. Right now, that's all you need to care about. I cared. Cared for seven years. <sighs> but now? It's all right. Take a moment. Fuck this. Need a smoke. Could get tense, he said. Yeah. Yeah. Let me try this. Give me a minute. You're gonna talk to her. Someone's gotta, and better me than you. <sighs> Couldn't wait till I was done. I'm V, by the way. Alex. <laughs> so NUSA is tossing us back into the fray, huh? Attention. On the mission? Yeah. Great song. Well, fire away. Serenade me. <laughs> you, right now. Am I looking at the real, Alex? What's it to you? I mean, what's the diff? What else can I say? Nobody who's anybody Wrong cares about the real Alex. What if I do? Then it's solely your problem. Now, about the mission. Spill. FIA agent went missing. Reed and I are tasked with finding her. And all of a sudden, FIA remembers I exist. You know Dogtown better than any other operative in their ranks. Their ranks? So you're not FIA. Curious. <sighs> what leverage they had on you. Deal's just for this one op, then I'm out. <laughs> Wouldn't count on brevity. Me? One in the same mission for the last seven fucking years. Been working the local arms and tech dealers since the war. My one op, that. Going real swell. Well, I got a lot less time than that. Always starts the same way. Do them a favor, they promise one in return. Sometimes even deliver. Then one day, they nail your dick to the wall. This ought mean that much to you? 
Because you're clearly hoping to get something out of it. Question is what? Survival. Woman we're after is offering something that could help me. Just gotta find her first. And by coincidence, Myers also wants her. Who the hell is this bimbo? Songbird. <sighs> Fuck me. Gonna take more than one sig to process that. Is she on that short list of peeps you don't serve here too? Never told you the whole story, did he? What story? Story of a clusterfuck op. One that led to Reed disappearing and me being holed up here for seven years. Here's the list of operatives. Reed, Songbird, and me. Haven't heard this, have you? <laughs> That's just perfect. Tell me you believe in coincidences? Or fuck it fate? Cause plug the same variables into an equation and surprise, gonna get the same fucking result. Shit in, shit out. <sighs> well, you and that hangdog Judas are in luck. Cause I got a nasty habit of repeating the same gonk mistakes. Got conditions though. So what's your ask? Monaco. Wanna burn rubber along the Riviera? Drink champagne on a yacht with a fucking duchess. Want a spy's retirement. Diplomatic posting in a warm, gob-smackingly gorgeous place where fruit off the trees is sweet and demand for fieldwork is zero. Think you can manage that? Top orders came from the in-U.S. press, so, yeah. Preem. Go back inside, tell him I'm in. Gonna need more nicotine before I look at his face again. Thanks, Alex. So? Didn't tell me the whole story, Reed. That's twice now. But it's taken care of. She'll do it. In exchange for? Wants a spy's retirement. Someplace nice. But if you ask me, she's itching to get closure after what went down between you two. So, heard you need someone to hold your hand, Reed. Take you on a tour of NC's asswart. I came to you because I trust you, Alex. If you say so. Fine. Songbird. Heard we gotta sniff her out. Song's MIA. Probably here in Dogtown. We were linked, comms like. Song ventured into cyberspace, then got attacked. She vanished just after. That's all we know. We need a net runner. Kind who spends all their waking hours parsing teraflops of data. Might have caught something. You have someone in mind? Wilkie Slider Laguerre. I should have figured. Went rogue a while back. But I know where that little rat nests. Slider? Care to fill me in? Renegade voodoo boy, murderer turned CI, all around piece of shit. Outside the net, he's blinder than three mice. Damaged occipital lobe. Not even a Kuroshi could mend it. How's an intel agency lose a blind man? Hold himself up with Haitian buddies. Operates a large scale tech and demon mill. Think Kabuki's home to Night City's soft sorcerers? <laughs> no. They're just there to push product. So, we paying him a visit? 
Slider hides out in a would-be spa in Luxor Heights. Flick you exact cords in two secs. Or rendezvous there. Alex and I have some, uh, catching up to do. Right. Just don't gouge each other's eyes out. Need both of you alive and healthy. See that tree there? Yeah, something special about it. Fitting, isn't it? How the prettiest thing here in Dogshed Town is a monument to the dead? Still don't get this gonk affinity for symbols and empty gestures. You're just butthurt because nobody ever lit a candle for you. Shit, maybe I am as sentimental as everyone else. When I see those two, Reed, Alex, went through something similar myself. What the hell could you possibly know about Reed, Alex, their relationship? See it clear as day. Any shred of friendship they've got left will fizzle out. Not right now, but soon. Could have spilled the truth years ago, stayed tunes. But no, stubborn old Reed had his orders. Just saying that because you never had real tunes. Did too during the war. Leaving them behind, going AWOL, took balls that. Think, how many times you willing to get burned before you stop trusting someone? There a point to all this? Replace someone with country or corp. How many times you gotta take a bullet for these motherfuckers in the name of empty promises? Chew on that when you look at those two. You haven't been waiting long, I hope. Well, guess you and Alex needed a while to catch up. Hmm, yeah. All swell now, though. Let's go. Time's at a premium. They posted lookouts. Go figure. I doubt they'll play nice and just let us in. Easy peasy, I say. Crack some skulls and roll in. I'd rather avoid a mess. But if that's the option you want... No harm in talking to him. Might let us through. You look like bad news. Turn around and crawl back to the hole you came from. Need to talk to Slider. No slider to speak of here, zombie. So kindly fuck the fuck off, eh? Manage to hammer shit out with Placide and Brigitte. No doubt I can manage slider. Ah, so you're the one the city boys have been talking about. Fine, go. Just make sure you behave. Spooky shit don't impress anyone, Slider. <laughs> Fuck me. Solomon Reed. I would be lying if I said I have missed you. And you? You put Mama Bridget under your spell. 
Will you bewitch me as well? Heard about me? Huh. How? Me, my temple. We are one. My eyes and ears are everywhere. This isn't a temple. It's a malicious demon mill. And you're no priest. You're a two-bit bandit and murderer. Murderer? Ha! It takes one to know one. So, what will it be? Will you strike a bargain with me as you did with that bitch, Bridget? Dunno. Don't know you yet, Slider. I am called many things. Wilkie Lager, the blind fury of the cyberspace. A thorn in the NUSA's fat ass. Take your pee. Yeah, you forgot to add double murderer and all-around coward. We're here to negotiate, Slider. Cut a deal. If one party is backed into a corner, it is not negotiation. It is extortion. You say tomato, I say fucking deal with it, Slider. Now, cut the shit and do us the courtesy of hearing us out. No love lost between the two of you, eh? Those who speak to Reed have a strange habit of vanishing or committing suicide. But since you are partners, you must know that by now. Speak your piece. Need some intel. Street says you're the one to get it. Me? <laughs> I am a blind man. I see nothing, know nothing. Cyberspace is my only field of vision. Well, just so happens what we need is one who knows cyberspace. Sees lots in it. Donc, Dimsa, what specifically do you want from me? Soon after SF1 crashed, a runner was attacked while in the net. Attack severed our link. Need to locate her, stat. Ah, so you want one to investigate net traffic on the day of the crash? Got a malfunctioning relic in my skull. That's how she made contact. That help any? Hmm. Perhaps. I will need a peek at this trinket in your head. <laughs> no, no chance, Slider. It is this or nothing. You choose. Keep your eyes on him, Reed. I am blind, not deaf. Let us see what we have here. I see traces, bursts of data in cyberspace, the wake of someone's passage. They're mad. This I do not believe. You out of your mind coming to me with this shit. What'd you see? The black wall. It bring only death. Specific, Slider. The woman. Did you know she used the black wall protocol to connect with you? Nope. Can't say I'm surprised, though. Foot, do you know what it is you bring me? Enlighten us. How to explain to layman? The net has layers, various vectors for translocation. But there is one thing that must not be touched. The black wall. The woman? She is walking, ticking bomb, megatons. She go boom, everybody fucked in the ass. Every last one. Miwanwa, 
It is a dam that protects us, the civilized world, from the strange bets of the cyber wilderness. If your two-leg bomb crack the dam down the middle, it will unleash a flood. Wipe us off the map, just like Haiti. Now why you and the Pacifica Voodoo's don't see eye to eye? Is there poking holes in the black wall? They do not penetrate. Only jerk off next to it. Let watch try to keep them in check. But you have to be cracked in the first place to want to stick your gigit into a live wire outlet. To the AIs, past the black wall, you are no more than a cockroach, a rabbit, a fragment of outdated code with no meaning. This why Netwatch flatline any who put integrity of black wall at risk. It's no laughing matter, my friend. It is a concern for the safety of all. That's why you, my friend, need to restore V's connection to our girl. You are out of your mind. Well, now you're part of this madness, too. Welcome to the shit show. More D. Non-negotiable, Slider. We need to find her. Besides, as long as she's out there, they catch her scent, they catch yours now, too. They'll set their wirehead freaks on to you and your people. So, you'll help me clean this up, cover all tracks, snip any threads leading back to you and consequently us. Do that, and we'll be square. You'll be off the FIA's hook, too. <sighs> Meld, it's my lucky day. Confirm the data transfer before I change my mind. Here we go. Exactly. Safe. Not exactly. Dust clear. Listen, babe. Don't have much time. Hans's people tracked me down after I res the Chimera. I've been... detained. I'm not in any danger. Not as long as I behave. Do what I'm told. I need to help. There's... Slider, what's going on? Something's not right, girl. Black water! Black Sapphire V. Hanson's hosting a huge shindig there. Crash it on the sly. I'll find you. Make sure to tell Reed. I have a set of Fuck! Is everything alright? I think Slider might be dead. Connection severed. It's over. You short sucked. Slider. He flatlined because of us. Flatline, period. Need you to come clean. Were you gonna off him no matter what? Questions, Moot. 
Slide is dead. What's done is done. So, Songbird. What's up with her? Got the link back up. We spoke. She's fine. Mostly. Needs our help, but she's fine. In one piece. All right. Give me the deets later. Time to doubt a V. Just because we got in without dropping bodies doesn't mean they'll wave us goodbye. Bon voyage, Slider. Get to work. Let's move on. Find a quiet corner. What did Songbird tell you? Seem glad that you and I have teamed up. Good. It means she trusts you. Anything else? Song needs our help, Reed. Hansen's nabbed her, holding her for reasons. God damn it. I can't imagine any worse news than that. Black Sapphire. Said Hansen's throwing a big bash there. We get in, she'll find us. Any idea what and where this sapphire is? Over there. See the tall of the two scrapers next to the one with the big ass screen? That's the Black Sapphire. What would be hotel ended up a failed multi billion eddy investment. Hence, us fortress smack in the middle of Dogtown. We can't just barge in. Doubt we have anyone on the inside or affiliated who could crack open a door either. Alex and I will pull some strings on our contacts. You do the same. You know, think of who you know around here. Maybe what will happen on an idea, find a way. No local fixer. Goes by Mr. Hands. Could ring him. Do it. We'll be in touch. Hands, need a favor. Straight to biz. I like it. Aiming to go to an upcoming shindig at the Black Sapphire. Lusting to dance with the devil. V, the place is inaccessible and treacherous in equal parts. You cannot simply walk in uninvited as opposed to, say, Conpeggy Plaza. Surely there's some way in. <sighs> Very well, I'll be frank. A handwritten invitation, unachievable, but I can work something out. I'll need a favor in return, though. Reputation is a currency. Its value derives from collective faith. It fluctuates. Do you understand me? Yeah, I see what you're driving at. Want me to help you earn a little rep? Precisely. Complete a few gigs for me, give my reputation in Dogtown a shot in the butt cheek. The Black Sapphire plans will be yours. All right, Hans. Got yourself a deal. I'm oh so glad. I'll feed her sane. Yeah, not like we got better shit to do than spend precious time on some teeny bopper gang drama. 
Want to see this through, Johnny? Shut it. Uh-huh. Do you think that makes you fucking clever? I'll teach you not to fuck- Gonna regret Get in this! Position. It hurts, huh? Fuck. This got ugly fast. <laughs> Give the old pockets a pick and a poke. Might get a lead on those kids. Fucker found out. Paco's likely hanging somewhere as a warning. Damn it. Fuck those cunts. <laughs> Fucking train wreck. Chum could be alive by some miracle. I still stand a chance. Paco. It's gotta be. Fuck me. Leaves the chick. If Hansen suspected her. She'd be swinging up there, too. Maybe. Who knows? There's a rare river dock who works pro bono, Anthony Anderson. Were it not for his clinic on Montana de Oro, Docktown's poor and unfortunate would have nowhere to turn. And so it happened. Scavenger struck. It appears they've an issue with Anderson himself. The good doctor shut his office, lost access to all comms. His man, Odell Blanco, awaits you at the clinic. Discuss the matter with him, and remember... Dr. Anderson's to remain unscathed. How's the dressing? Still dry? Stitches on in place? Dude, it hurts like hell. I can barely Adele stand. Blanco? Name's V. Fixer said you need a hand. <laughs> More like a miracle. If the scabs don't scatter soon, our patients will start dropping in the street. Looks like a woman's implant. Not adjusted to your weight. What? Like I had my pick of chrome? Nah, just gotta tweak the load capacity. Knee joint settings first. See if that helps. Huh. Now well, that we haven't tried. What do the scavs want from the head doc? Well, there's this girl with them, Nika Yankovic. Said she's looking for her brother. What, he a patient of yours? Look, that's all I know. She wanted to talk to Anthony and seemed really upset. Anderson locked himself in his office. Yes. It's the only spot with any security. Find the altar, hang a right. Stairs will take you to the basement. If the scavs hurt Anthony, well, then all these people are out of luck. Leave it to me.
Stay back! Where's Gaspar? Tell me! Chill. Gun down. Let's talk. Here for Anderson. Need him out of here, alive. And I'm here for my brother. Couldn't give a fuck about this quack. You! Off your ass! Where's Gaspar? Thought about switching up your game? That iron's not making much of an impact. I'm sorry, do you work for me or the scavs? Talk for fuck's sake! Ah, oh, fuck! You, Merc! Help me! No, not zeroing anyone just because you don't want to use your words. I can't fucking believe this. Gasper's dead. What? You're lying! He was just a little sick! Your brother was so high out of his mind, it scorched his metabolic editor. The kid was in a coma before he even hit the table. Huh? How'd he die? Morphine injection. His remaining implants were at risk, and I've got patients who need them. To hell, your other patients! You... You fucking murder- Am I hearing this right? You flatlined a patient just to save a few eddies? Me? I profit from none of this. There was nothing I could do. Why delay the inevitable? We'll extract his implants. They'll go to people who still need them. You won't lay a goddamn finger on him. Give me my brother. No! No. What did you say? Fuck! Uh, help! Where's his body? Fuck off, Scav! Your brother's gone. I won't let him get Gaspar. Accept it. Let Anderson go. Finally. You couldn't have done that from the start? Did what you hired me for. That don't mean I think Nika's wrong. One thing. Merc, unless you've spent the day in my shoes, in my clinic, doing my job, you've got no right to judge me. The patients, what's their status? With Odell, out in the street waiting. Tell him it's all clear. It's the time we got back to work. Premium work, V. I offered to send a hand to remove all those scavenger remains, but Anderson declined. Something about taking a look at them first. I can only assume he's in shock. The funds are being transferred as we speak. Your job is finished. V, I had a nightmare recently. My synth lungs were hacked. I choked, turned blue, then lost consciousness and woke up. My client, Indira Baratso, won't be so lucky if she doesn't strike a deal with her blackmailer. The lowlife in question, Milko Alexis. He works for the Voodoo Boys. You know what to do. If anything's unclear, read the attached details. Oi! Just here on Biz! You have Biz with the Voodoo Boys? Yeah. Well, used to. After what you just did, thinking they'll want a new supplier. Milko Alexis, a Voodoo Boy. Know the name? Yeah. About all I know, though. Guy practically lives in the net. Seems like he's got everyone walking on eggshells. Big deal, I guess. Where can I find him? Don't ask me. Got enough problems as it is. Came here to make a few ads, right? 
Tell me what I want to know, and you will. Now you're speaking my language. Right, so these implants. The voodoos break most of them down. Looking for code exploits, new hacks, and so on. Whatever they don't use, they install in old robots. Piles of scrap, most of them, but one came together real nice. Robots? What for? What for? Think for a sec. If this Milko guy's so important, probably needs round-the-clock protection. Help the Voodoo Boys build a small army. Surely you know how to beat it. How's your aim? I manage. Hmm. The Voodoos, they keep their bots in some kind of server room. I can overload the disk arrays, then you... You fuck up the servers till they go boom. Should result in a pulse big enough to melt the cirques of the rank and file. Okay, feel free to Delta. I got work to do. Mmm, must be nice. Activating defense systems, 40%. Protocol. Unlocking emergency exit. Hey, hey. Careful with that. I'm linked to the runner. See? Don't want him to catch a ricochet, huh? Netrunner, blackmailer, murderer. He's my hit. He has some dirt under his nails, yeah. But Milko is a known. A small fish in a big pond. I am Agent Alan Noel, Netwatch. Organized crime specialist. I'm sure we can work something out. Okay, Agent Alan Noel, Netwatch Organized Crime Specialist. Get out of my way. At least let me unplug from Nico. Fine. But so much as a twitch, and you're a flatline. That's better. Now, listen to me. You can't kill Milko. Not yet. Who's gonna stop me? You? Do not do this. will fill you in. Best of luck. Stella? Something the matter? Get down. Can't get spotted by Dodger's men. Wouldn't it be easier to just move the car? Folding the seats might not cut it. Listen, this is serious, okay? You don't mess with Dodger's people. Okay, sure.
Need your help with my fiancé, Bill, and his buddy, Charlie. They're trapped in the building across the street. Hans mentioned they're both in CPD? Both grade-A gonks, too. Sometimes do side gigs around town. Wanted to cut a deal with Dodger, but things obviously went south. Bill called me from inside, said only that, and I quote, it's bad. And if I don't get help, Dodger will paint the walls with their brains. It's bad. Nothing else? It's really bad, Stella. Please get help. I love you. Sweet of him, but not really what I was after. When I asked what happened, he said it was too complicated for a quick hollow. Why is Dodger got you all shaken at the knees? He's a dealer with close ties to Hansen. Total psycho, too. Moved to Dogtown to avoid serious prison time. Just please try not to wipe Dodger's men. You'll make things go from bad to worse. Take this access card. Dodger took over an abandoned NCPD precinct. Security systems are still up and running, so this should get you in without a hitch. Upside's a last-gen NCPD tech, huh? Save them. Please. Who's asking? Charlie or Bill? It's Charlie. So Stella did manage to find someone. Thank fuck. Okay, let's try to get this open. Fucking slab this thing. Little help. Come on. Jesus fucking Christ. I know. What the fuck? Don't worry. Not my blood. <laughs> the hell happened? Uh, better see for yourself. It's just through here. What in the... This is Bill. Hi. Who's your friend? Uh, who, me? Just told you, I I'm Bill. Thanks, Bill, got that. No, I mean the dead fucking body on the table you somehow failed to mention to Stella? We, we, we didn't kill him, okay? We, we, we swear. Let's see. Two blood-soaked dudes locked in a room with a gutted corpse. Yeah, real puzzler. Bet it'd take ages for a detective to unravel this one. Go on. Tell her about your genius idea. My idea? You're the one who Plan set up the deal with was Dodger. was rock fucking solid. If only you didn't leave a bag of drugs in front of a junkie. How was I supposed to know he'd swallow it? You said drugs? Oh, you go. No, you. I swear to fucking God. Went like this. Choom over here clips Dodger's shit. Hightails it to NC. We catch wind, Dodger's put out a bounty to bag him. Bring back his nose candy. Bump right into him during a routine stop. Dumb fucking luck. Choom was carrying seven ounces of Sin Coke. So we cuffed him. Took him here. Choom swallowed seven whole ounces? That even possible? 
So we're here, waiting on Dodger, when Bill pops the baggie on the table like it's nothing. All of a sudden, this gonk turd yells, fuck you pigs, and stuffs the bag in his mouth. Could've had a food tube implant, like a deep, wide throat. Yeah, like the one your mom's got. Why fuck would you he even do that? Talking Makes about no Bill. sense. Fuck if I know. It's not like he made a list of pros and cons. Bag must have broke because he got all foamy at the mouth. Started spazzing out and then just croaked. That's when we started to panic. This fool gulped tens of thousands worth of eddies. What the fuck else are we supposed to do? If the bag already broke, why bother trying to play Operation? We panicked, all right? Shit happens. <sighs> this... It's all gone. Dissolved. And now Dodger's gonna end us. So you bring him the thief who swiped his dope. Only now, there's no thief. Or dope. Yeah. It's about the gist of it. You gotta help us get out of here. Couldn't it just up and left on your own? Well... We kind of left our iron in the squad car. Just keeps getting better. Where is it? In the garage. To the garage, It's official, V. Finally made it to the major leagues. League of first-class leadheads, to be precise. Nice of you to join us, Johnny. Well, Always Stella's follow gonna your kill answer. me if she finds out what we did. I'm a dead man walking. Know what you could use? What? A nice big pair of balls. Oh, cause you're such a tough guy? Not like you stutter in front of the cap every fucking time. I don't fucking stutter. Let us through here before. What was the code again? 2893? It was 2983. Idiot, it was 2893. Saw him punch it. Go on. Didn't work. Ha! <laughs> 2983, I fucking told you. Dodger school. Hey, no killing, all right? Got enough problems as it is. Shit, another door. Sealed tight. Again? Come on, guys. Hey, this wasn't us, okay? Gotta be a switch around here somewhere. Dodger will drown us in eddies, Bill. The plan is foolproof, Bill. Trust me, I know what I'm saying, Bill. <sighs> Shut up, Bill. So what if it's fucking Pacifica? What, too pussy to set foot there, Bill? Afraid of earning some serious scratch? Says the asshole who couldn't keep a bag in his fucking pocket. cars right through here. You do have them, don't you? The keys. Shit. Wait, don't tell me you left them upstairs. Chill, Jewel. Got them right here.
Got hired by these two to help. Oh, <laughs> they look like they could use a hand, all right. One thing I can't put my finger on, though. What's that you got on your faces? A little ketchup? Run out of napkins? Uh... Yeah, well... Uh, no, not us. Per se. You any better at speaking full sentence? Um... Uh, there was a shootout. A, a, a guy got hit. It was, was bleeding out fast. Uh, after that, brought your stuff here. Uh, left it all upstairs, so... It's all good. Another smooth talker. All right. Third time's a charm. Is he spinning yarns? It's all true. Happened exactly as Bill said. That's unfortunate. See, I really don't like being made a fool of. Boys. Oh, you're fucked now! <laughs> go, go! Fucking trying! Everything's going to shit! Safe to come out. Dodger ain't breathing. Is it over? Yep. Nothing left but to hop in your ride, flee the scene. I'm sure you can manage that much. Thanks. So are we going or what? Yeah, yeah. Hey, thanks again. Hey, I'll radio us in. Tell them we're back. Wait, I'll get Stella on the phone first. V, so tell me, what did our boys in blue do this time? Let me put it this way. This is the last time I do a gig for the badges. Prickly today, are we? I'll make do without details. If the client is happy, then so am I. Contract closed. Hey, hold, hang on a sec, Hans. Remember our deal? Yes, the Black Sapphire. I have an entry strategy for you. Foolproof. Meet me at the Heavy Hearts. Okay, be there soon. This is a nice place, so play nice, hear me? Got our eyes everywhere. Get back to work now, okay? Okay. Ah, if it isn't V. V, my favorite Merc. Splendid. What you completed for me significantly shifted the playing field vis-a-vis -vis Hanson. Excellent work, precisely as requested. Maybe the one thing I didn't expect, to see the man behind the hollow curtain. The elusive Mr. Hands in the flesh. Not only did you rescue those clowns in blue, you also managed to eliminate Dodger. Calm, collected, and professional. Bravo. You have proven to be a person I can trust. Hence my decision to drop the veil and meet in person. A rare occurrence, I assure you. Were I to have more virtuosos like you, 
I wager I'd have more than Dogtown in my grasp. Dogtown, Pacifica, then I'd line up the rest, snort, and it'd be done. Working with bona fide professionals, positively a treat. Gigs you had me do. How will they solve your Hansen sitch? Take a boxer. He can't knock out his opponent. What then? He goes to work on the body. Once his adversary's stamina wanes, he looks for his opening, connects fists with jaw. I know it may not seem all that clear from where you stand, but the gigs you have completed will allow me to audaciously shift some of the pawns and figures on the chessboard that is Dogtown. Checkmate is but a few moves away. Take it you'd prefer Dogtown with no Hansen at the helm? Hansen wields much power, greedily so. He's also clever. These traits I tolerate, even value, when occurring in isolation. But all at once, no. Especially not in one who grips an entire district in the palm of his hand. It makes business... trying. And arrest you in some tea. It's my own blend. Sure, why not? So, how did this combat zone become Dogtown? Do you know? I heard this and that. Something to do with the war? 2069. Colonel Hansen led an operation colorfully called Midnight Storm. The objective? to occupy this combat zone and establish an NUSA staging ground in Night City. Soon after, the sides agreed to a ceasefire. Hansen's force was left to fend for itself. Headquarters, the public, everyone feigned ignorance, pretending Hansen and company were never here. But our good colonel decided to put down roots. He declared this combat zone an NUSA territory. In our terms, he carved out an enclave for himself and went from soldier to arms dealer overnight. Marooned he was. Two weeks for a bullet to reach his brain, everyone thought. But his brain remained intact and he became a force to be reckoned with. A man whose existence is a threat to many is a dangerous man indeed. Let's table politics for now, huh? Go straight to biz? Business. Of course. The Black Sapphire. Hanson stronghold guarded by elite soldiers. Military quarters are situated on lower levels, while top floors are a decadent haven for the ultra-rich. The building's blueprint was not easily procured, I should say. Hansen guards his hotel secrets as if they were an embarrassing rectal itch. But given a will, ways are usually found. You help a client of mine, they reciprocate, and I gain latitude. Quid pro quo in full effect. The building plans are yours. I'll even throw in vulnerabilities to watch for, a token of my appreciation. And, though this goes without saying, the data, its source, are completely secure. No one knows you have it. Data leaks, or lack thereof, are the difference between myself and, say, the late Mr. Deshawn. The Shard. Black Sapphire and Phone Blueprints. All nooks and crannies. I trust it's all you need to waltz in and perform your planned pirouettes. Yet a word of caution. Even fully prepared, you'll be marching into a pit full of vipers. Watch your step.
Thanks, Hans. I only hope this won't mark the end of our collaboration. Truth be told, a few new assignments seem imminent. Let me guess. More local political gaming? Activity is abundant in Dogtown, and behind closed doors, plots and schemes. Should change ever occur, as it inevitably must, someone really ought to pave the way for a smooth transition. Nice meeting you. Finally pinning a face on the name. You should count yourself lucky. Few have done so and lived to tell the tale. And V, whatever happens at the Black Sapphire, make sure you come back alive, hmm? You're going where local and international politics mix. Strong currents, both. I'll make sure to plant my feet firmly then. Later, hands. Ticket into the Black Sapphire. Perfect. Send you. No worries. This connection is secure. Catch. It's on its way. And reception complete. I'll pass it on to Alex. And as soon as you're ready, join us at the moth. If I'm not there when you arrive, just wait. Till then. Get used to it. This the relic? Gets worse every day. Time I have left evaporating quick. You experience them often? These attacks? Don't really keep count, but never know if the next one won't be my last. No shit. Death's breathing down my neck. Always. I know what that feels like. Being a dead man walking? Exactly. I never talked about this, you know. I should be saying they tried to kill me. But sometimes it feels like they actually succeeded. Tell me more. Ambush. Attempt on my life seven years back. Yeah, he said. What exactly happened there, Reed? I landed in the ICU. While I waited for some Arasaka goon to come finish me off. 
I was betrayed by our people, the FIA. I say betrayed, but I was sold out. Part of a deal, a peace offering, my head on a silver platter, all for a ceasefire. Peace comes at a price. Someone's always got to pay it. Come on, I want to show you something. Hang on. They set you up, yet here you are working for them again. Even deep wounds stop hurting eventually. Scar over. A few years on, they're just a niche. Let's go. Let's ride down. Where are we headed? On a little trip down memory lane. To see some old junk. I still can't believe Alex decided the best place for a bar was right over our old safe house. She's always had a twisted sense of humor. Where's she at? Waiting downstairs? She's finishing up recon in town. We should make ourselves at home until she gets back. Been dark for seven years, this place. Let's brighten things up again. The end of any war is never pretty. Both sides race to tie up loose ends. A car bomb blew up one of my crew. Another was poisoned. A third got shot in the back of the head while buying a pack of smokes. A couple others just vanished without a trace. Every night we waited for Arasaka agents to come finish us off. I had to make a choice. I chose to dig our heels in. I thought we still had a fighting chance. It was bold. It was stupid. A mix of both. Maybe I just didn't know how to walk away. Let it rest. Or maybe I don't know how to lose. Either way, we managed to save a few more agents. The price for that was yours truly. Say what you want. It sounds like they stabbed you in the back, plain and simple. Saving many of my people in the process. You play grown-up games, you face grown-up consequences. Funny. Not of everyone. It was Songbird they asked to pull the trigger. Wait. Yeah. Pulled the trigger as in literally took out her iron and shot you. Not personally, but she unlocked the door for those who came and did. I was leaving the city, heading home. Songbird was still here, in this very room, in fact. He was guiding me on comms, led me straight into a trap. Neutralizing me, the last assignment in Night City. Then she got a ticket home. And yet you're now trying to save her. Why? Because it's the right thing to do. I had plenty of time to examine this under a microscope. Under focus, some things sharpen, others blur. But there comes a point when you just cut through the bullshit and see what's in front of you. Songbird is still my people, and nothing can change that. Fuck, Reed. Now, my ears is a whole nother story. But Songbird, no. I got nothing against her. So why Myers? I miss anything? Some reminiscing. So good, let's get this show going. I checked up on Slider's contention. Fucking had it right, it turns out. 
I dove into old mission files wherever Somi was involved. They were buried deep, near impossible to access, even with my clearance. Each and every one, the Blackwall. All authorizations, mission orders, personally signed by one person, Rosalind Myers. Wouldn't want to be in her shoes if that shit floats to the top. The NUS is a small country governed by a woman with highly ambitious goals. Sometimes those ambitions went out of reason. But that's not something we need to pour over now. Alex, what do you have for us? Oh, a little of this, a little of that. We'll plan in a sec. Say, V, like playing fancy dress up? What's the matter? Gotta do what needs doing. Preferences be damned. All right, little Miss Sourpuss. Managed to learn that some pop megastar is gonna grace the party with a show. Guest list? Expect everybody who's anybody. That includes you. Gonna don fancy outfits and rub shoulders with VIPs. Be warned though, fancy doesn't mean easy. Ready for the deets, V? Let me hear them. Black Sapphire, the most heavily guarded place in Dogtown. Doesn't mean security's airtight, though. V, you're gonna enter through a flooded tunnel system. Got a top-of-the-line diving suit, ought to fit you snug as a glove. Water's maybe a little super toxic. So yeah, be careful. Toxic how, exactly? Hmm, from suspect waste, some sewage leak too. Don't worry, suit's pissing shit-proof. Already know what the hotel looks like. Really, really hard to miss. Flooded tunnels here. That's your way inside. Now focus. You'll reach a terminal at the end. Jack in and breach the cams, giving Reed his window to slip into the building. You'll take different elevators up, here. Saul will open a passage to his side. For you ask, yeah, it's the only way. Area could be heavily guarded, so you'll have to be on your tippy toes. Couldn't get clean intel, so you'll just have to be creative. Improvise. You're gonna meet here. Soon as you meet up, you'll doll up like it's prom night and go to the ball. That's where you'll rendezvous with Songbird. All clear? Okay, how are we getting in again? You're swimming in through flooded tunnels. Reed will take the high road after you let him inside. Sound good? Yup. Prem. Okay. Let's talk gear. Take your time. Grab anything you think might be useful. A surprise awaits you in the box. This your iron? Sure is. Her Majesty's been itching to return to active duty. I'd be honored. That reminds me. Hands. What did he want in return for the favor he did us? Hands has the mind of a corpo. War's like a biz to him. Runs it that way. He pits everyone against each other. By the time they realize they're all fighting on his behalf, it'll be too late. Politics. It's the same shit wherever you go. You know, if not for you, We'd have no way of getting into the Black Sapphire reaching Somburg. It's good to have you on our side. I mean that, V. That it? We set? I believe we are. I'll hang back a while and then meet you there. Reed, you copy? Made it to the hallway. Copy you loud and clear. I'm in position too.
I'm in the water. Good. Now find a way to the other side. In the meantime, I'll do some recon around the hotel. Flooding these tunnels must have been Hanson's idea. He probably lacked the manpower to secure all the passages. I found a breach in their defenses. I should be inside momentarily. Out. If it is, then either it's been stolen or I'm just fucking blind. Are you still there? Sure am. I'm at the warehouse gate. You'll need to secure the area, crack it open from the other side. Oh, there you are. What's the sitch? See a gate. Two guards. Don't worry about them. Give me open that gate. There you go. I've acquired elevator access. Come right to the top. Get moving. I'll meet you there. Roger that. Stay sharp. We're in the wolf's den now. You scared of him? Handsome. The man has repeatedly told both the NUSA and NYSE to go fuck themselves. He should have been put down long ago. Instead, he rules this entire district. Not so you are scared. This is Hanson's surf. He has the upper hand. It's just a fact that needs accepted. Does it mean I'm shaking at the knees? I don't know. All right, find a vantage point to have eyes on me. Neutralize any and all threats. Call and quiet. Drop the sniper. Nesting in his perch now. At the perfect vantage point, saw everything. Cover me. You're in prime duck hunting position. New user detected. Calibration in progress. Firing mode inactive. I'm in position. Do you have a visual on me? I got you. What now? We do this nice and quiet if we can, got it? Spot any guards in my way, you give me a heads up. Don't worry, boss. Rifle sports a silencer if it comes to that. Let her look around. Got a mine just past the corner. Oh, spotted. I could have missed it. Healthy smattering of guards along your path. Copy that. We'll take them out one by one. Best if they never knew we were here. Patrol incoming. Got eyes on them. Remember that too. Let's go. The guards could have spotted me, V. I need you to deal with them before they're on me. Clear. You can make your way to the bridge. Fine work.
Silky smooth work, V. Well played. I'm impressed. Let's head to the elevator. Follow me. We don't have all day. Almost there, V. Fucking finally. You're looking a little pale. Little deja vu is all. Different elevator, different hotel. The sits didn't turn out great. What makes you say that? It's my job to notice things like this. How many ops you been on? Ballpark. One of the number of years you've been around. But right now, we're crashing the party of a bad boy dictator. While aiming to walk you out with his prized possession. Dress up time. Throw on your new threads and plaster on your best fake smile. A party awaits. We're all set. Yeah, you're a real looker. Now come on. Gotta hand it to Hanson, V. Party's hopping. Has a sense of grandeur. Didn't have shit like this in my day. Now hop on over there and help me out. Manage to forget what real champagne tastes like. You should be asking who's not here. NCPD commission, bar, politicians, me. diplomats, Welcome. celebrities, corporate... Would you care for a beverage? Don't mind if I do. A pleasant evening to you. I mean, they want to gobble up what he's serving. Appreciate it. Thanks. You watch. This isn't about who has the right credentials. You just have to. The drinks up. Aim to get fucked up on Hanson's dime, then puke all over his carpets? Respect. Thanks a lot. What now? I know as much as you do. All she said was to come here. She'll either find us, or she left us something. And you? What's your play? Think I'm starting to feel the vibe. Just remember what we're here for. To my right, boots far back behind the stairs. The guy in the fatigues. Looks like he came here straight from a firing range. Owner of the Black Sapphire, Mr. D-Town himself, Kurt Hansen. Clearly having a great night in the company of the NCPD commissioner. PA broadcast. He fiercely anti-law enforcement. It's an act. Behind closed doors, he's rubbing elbows and patting backs of NCPD's top brass. Avoid him, especially in the confrontation. Beside that, stay visible. Songbird said she'd find us here. Let's give her a chance. I'll grab a drink and look around. Open line on comms. Don't press anyone too hard. We need to keep up appearances. Look like you're having fun. Stage entrance, artists only. Just in case you're still wondering why I hate corporate rats and political whores. You're a hired gun and petty thief, but I'd say your presence at this party is still raising the moral bar. Yeah, I can see that. You look a little lost. I'm saying, me one and only. <laughs> Wouldn't you feel like keeping me company for the rest of the evening, would you? 
Ned's still young. Later, maybe. Right. Okay. Watch it. So, Kurt Hansen, Duke of Dogtown, in the flesh. More mutt than alpha hounds. but I'm sure. It's so good you're here. Don't know what I'd do without you, V. Really. Good to finally meet you in the flesh, face to face. The way our last combo ended was... troubling. The, uh, runner. Your friend. Who, who helped us reconnect last time. Killed him. Fried him, didn't I? Well, could say we brought death to his door. Guess the two of us just lucked out. I ran out of time to explain everything. Saul, I've made so many mistakes. It's all right, son. Not your fault. The blame's on us. All of it. On you? I is all of them. I know what they made you do. They pushed and pushed, and I... <sighs> I wasn't there to stop it. Listen, guys. We do not have the time for this now. Right. Main thing is to get you out of here. That's... Not happening. It is. We got in, we can get out. Just Not the me. point. I'm dying, Saul. Like V. Hansen has the cure we need. We run now, we both die. Relic's killing V. Blackwall's my poison. I can't bow out now. Oh. <laughs> Sharon and Boat to Oblivion with me? Could have said something. Had no time. Still don't. But hear me out. I need help. Your help. Hansen pulled some tech out of a bunker under Dogtown. Tech that could cure both V and me. We need to clep it. Only way I see of doing that is to stay close. Play the prisoner. Oh, fuck. We'll wait for an opportunity and pounce. I'll be on the inside. Ask for your help when the time's right. I can flee once I have that tech. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Ah. So me. Care to introduce your friends? It's not often I'm simply not familiar with guests attending my own party. And I never forget a face. Kurt Hansen. Name's V. Just V. Haven't seen so me in years. Trying to catch up. Oh, that's what this is. To me, reunions consist of picking up the broken, scattered shards of your heart. Or teeth. Always hurts. Well, I need to grab you, darling. I have a couple NC politicos here who are dying to meet you. And if we're to keep hungry rats from devouring Dogtown, we really do need to feed them the occasional scraps. I'm all yours, Kurt. See you soon, V. Established our link the moment I touched you. Interesting. 
I need a minute to process. And I need a drink. Heading downstairs. I'll explain everything. Just need you to listen. What's the deal? Song. Doubt I've ever seen a prisoner parade around in a cocktail dress at a swanky party. Not to mention being hella friendly with their captor. It's a charade, V. Doing what I need to survive, to get what I want. I'm letting Hansen show me off like his personal trophy. V, I... I can't explain everything now. It's... too much. But I really do need your help. All I want is to get that cure for us. It's what I've been chasing all along. Not liking this. Not a bit. I don't like my situation either. It's very shit for all three of us. There, I said it. The cure. How do we get it? We need the Neural Matrix. Secret tech that incorporates AIs from beyond the Black Wall. The Matrix is nested in a mainframe Hansen pulled out of the bunker. The mainframe secured, but Hansen lacks the key. That's the problem. Neural Matrix? What is it, exactly? In short, it's storage. A carrier for an AI trapped within certain boundary conditions. When the AI is triggered, it'll execute what's stipulated within those conditions. But I really can't go into detail now. We don't have the time. Wait, what's the rush? I might be talking to you, but in the flesh I'm with Hansen. I'll need to focus. Play nice in a minute, or he'll suspect something's up. Got a plan? Spill it. Hansen needs me and a duo of runners who worked on this tech in the past. They actually grabbed access codes they're willing to unload for a price. Classic black market shit. They're bringing access, I'm bringing know-how about how to pull the matrix and data off the mainframe. We're to work side by side, giving us a chance. You clip the access codes, then get the runners out of the way. You'll then impersonate them for a meet with Hansen. Same meet where we'll swipe the Matrix out from under his nose. So, runners... were to impersonate him? How? Personality theft tech. Firm kind of specializes in it. Alex and Reed know it well, they'll explain. Of all people, couldn't have imagined those two would be on our side, helping. This job, this whole story about Hansen. Not adding up something fierce, Song. You're hiding something, still. I don't have time to explain the ins and outs now. V, please, we need the Matrix. Focus on the runners, find them. They're here, downstairs. Red-headed twins, walled to the teeth with ice. Grocery scans will show you bunk. You're blowing me off. Champagne glass over there. Prep some intel for you. Get it to read. You'll need it later. Really need to go now, V. I'm counting on you. Songbird. And she's gone. Seems your special agent has special needs. Trying to drown his sins and sorrow. Thanks. Talk to Songbird via the Relic. We can communicate again. Hmm. All good there, Reed? Yeah. I just need to process for a minute. It's just how I'm built. A little adversity and I need a few moments to think. Come up with anything? Yeah. We now know who took a swipe of Myers's head. What are you thinking? Don't know about you, but I see coincidences as patterns. Structures we have yet to recognize. Huh. What you driving at? SF-1 crashes. Not anywhere, but over specific turf. Controlled by someone who found some obscure forgotten tech in a secret bunker. Right. Crash was an inside job. We suspected that from the get-go. 
Now we know it was. And we know it was Songbird. She was behind it. Too early for conclusions, don't you think? Got no proof she planned this in advance. Could have improvised. Reacted to facts. Come on. You know, they actually think she learned about the cure just now. She made a deal with Hanson earlier. Had to. Before any of this went down. Traded the president's life for access to the tech. <sighs> Don't know about that. Song recruited me specifically to pull Myers out of that wreck. I seriously doubt she wanted her dead or snatched by Hanson. It's never that simple, V. As I see it, Somi was playing both sides, simultaneously spinning deals with Hanson and you. She has Hanson set, then you come in. She contacts you via the relic, asks you to rescue the president. Absolution for her right there. You need to cure just as much, guaranteeing you'll help if her plan falls through. And here we are. Yeah, and here we are, rushing to Songbird's rescue. Thinking a few steps ahead was always her strength. But judgment calls and situational assessment, her Achilles heel. As a chess master, she'd be famous for dazzling plays and excruciatingly beautiful defeats. Sheesh, don't know what to believe just yet. That's not surprising. But I know Somi well enough to know she'll do her damnedest to be fair. Right. Just branded your beloved Bella the Ball, who you're out to rescue, a traitor. Well, now, what do you want to do about it? You know, V, treason ain't ever black and white. They try to zero me once, too. What if we've all been played? Main thing now is to get her out of this cesspool of a sitch, and we'll see which direction to take. Right. Still should watch her every move closely. Sure. Unconditional trust? No more. Out the window. Right. Back to the sitch at hand. What do we have to do to save her? To grab the tech Songbird and I both need, we gotta go to a meet with Hanson. Prep for it's required. Because we show up as a pair of runners. Need to clep their identities first. Whatever that means. Personality imprint theft. Sounds like our Colombian job of yore. Who are they and where do we find them? So how's one go about it? Clepping someone's personality? FIA Menanthropic Tech. Alex has access. You seem to use it already. You look, sound, and act like the individual whose personality you assume. To do it, we need scans of our targets. Song got this shard to me. Take a look. Our targets are a brother and sister, red-haired twins. They're here somewhere, schmoozing. Hmm. Okay, we need to pull data. Get samples of assorted behavior. We make contact with them, talk, scan as we talk. Got it. I think. So, time to make our move? Over there. Wow. Traced them to Flash, Reed. Noticed them some time ago. They stand out even in this mountain pot. Twin roulette, looks like. Alex, you copy that? Radio loud and clear. Prep and scan tech now. You're new to this, but relax. We'll do it as a four-hander. I scan one, you handle the other. Alex will pilot us through. V, zipping funds your way from our operating budget. Load up on chips and join their game. Just don't go all in from the get-go. We stagger our approach, and we're strangers. Let's get to this. Struck gold with roulette, really. Gambling throws people around, high and low, brings the joy of winning and the despair of defeat. Perfect for our purposes. Greetings, madam. Wanna buy some chips? Of course. Good luck at the tables. V, important. You're not
not there to have fun. Simple bets, red or black only. None of the double street or basket bullshit, understood? Understood. Bettings open? By all means. Black it is then. Relax. Buy him drinks, break the ice. I'll join you momentarily. All bets are in. Betting is closed. What? No introduction? V. You? Aurore Cassel. And that boar is my brother, Emmerich. How's things? Any luck? We started just moments ago. What's your poison? My treat? A bourbon for me. Alas, mon frère does not drink. You heard the lady. And real water for the gentleman here. And what'll you have? Same as the lady. Bourbon coming up. Your drinks will be here shortly. One. Odd. Red. Et merde! Place your bets, please. <gasps> Last chance. Black. Let's go, let's go. B. Can't get a hold of Reed. No idea where he is. Stall for time, okay? Hmm, I just realized. Uh, you must have dirt beneath your fingernails too. Like all these bastards and bitches. That is, unless you're uh, in tourist, like the no-lifers who must watch others live to feel anything. Provocative, this one. Yeah, conscience ain't sparkling clean. No. Mmm, I like those who brag about such things. Fifteen. Odd. Black. A defeat. Ah! Fichy. Fucking done here! Duh! <sighs> Place your bets, please. I can't help feeling I, uh, interrupted something when I walked up. Do not worry yourself about this. Oh, come, come. V is just being cordial. N'est-ce pas, V? You weren't snooping just now, Pretty were you? Even. Black. Still no sign from Reed, V. Gotta sink a villain about this. Place your bets, please. Eight's my magic number, so... Ah, oh, you got me. <laughs> On to you big time. But in my defense, you guys stand out. Even in a crowd like this one. Oh, really? Listening to conversations of strangers can be... dangerous. Sometimes you can hear more than you can handle. Listen. Reed's MIA for now, can't wait for him. Gotta do both scans on your own. We were discussing local politics, specifically our host, Monsieur Kurt Hansen. Big fish selling big guns for big money. Yet here you have celebrities, politicians, even the chief of police. So I was thinking, uh, perhaps Hansen would do better by being a veritable businessman, no? I claim he would. Mon cher frère disagrees. 21. Odd. Red. Ugh. Guess it's not my lucky day. Place your bets, please. Who is Kurt Hansen really? A crucial question. Tread carefully with that duo, V. Hansen's a suit without a suit, if you catch my drift. Oh my fucking god, you Americans. You used to have more imagination. Tossing you around, V. Don't let her. Level the field. Ask a gonk question, get a gonk answer. Deservedly, I'd say. <laughs> Touché. 
Empty banter aside, a stupid man the colonel is not. He should um, diversify revenues and assets. Six, even, black. Place your bets, please. Tu ne serais pas en train de devenir trop pote avec elle On fait pas tant jaloux, petit frère. C'est pas comme si on allait baiser, elle et moi. Pretty shameless bastard, aren't you? Oh, I agree. I mean, Hansen could take Dog down by the throat, eject the junkies, and make it a paradise for billionaires. Just getting rich is dull. You should work for the community. Invest, create jobs, throw banquettes. She's getting chatty. You're doing good, V. And charities are excellent washing machines. You launder billions, believe me. 29 on black. Place your bets, please. You're so childish. It's beautiful. What? Hansen going missionary position in business? Nonsense. <sighs> Reed's still not responding. But you keep working it. Let's go. Swap twins. Sister's right, you know. Legit biz. Lots better, safer than the gangster shit. Oh, please. What would he do? Build homes? Strip malls? He is very good at what he does. A professional criminal. Soldier yesterday, crime lord today. Why not biz shark tomorrow? Yet he is a businessman. And to make it legal, it is a lot of work to do for a simple change of label. Good. Little worms opening up. Seventeen. Odd. Black. Place your bets, please. Don't got much respect for upright honest peeps, do you? Allow me to say, V. Arms or property, it would make no difference to me what I sell. And to spend five years on efforts to uh, change how people see you, call you. To be upstanding in the eyes of others. I could not give a shit. Three. Odd. Red. Ah, damn. I should have bet on red. Place your bets, please. Getting there. Almost got it. Give me something big now. Make him laugh or cry, I don't care. Please, please. Like the tingle of risk? Oh, ma vieille, t'as pas d'idée. Thinking we can add a little spice to our game. I'm listening. My, my, I too, I'm curious. How about we go all in? Bet everything we won tonight. And we play different colors, yes? You win or we do. And either you or we lose all. My thoughts exactly. A moment. You join the table, buy drinks, talk and talk. Now you wish to risk everything? I find this disquieting. Perhaps you could now tell us about yourself. Tread lightly. Name's V, afterlife affiliated. Make what you will of it. Oh, are you happy now? You choose first, then. Black's my choice. Uh, we are red. As our hair. A luscious color. Allez, 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 allez! You win some, you lose some, folks. Leave us for a moment, if you please. A goodbye, then. I know your friend Reed is FIA. My natural assumption is you're an agent, too. I'm also guessing you two took it upon yourselves to save the president, then exfil her out of Dogtown. I should send you back to Night City in body bags. 
filled with pieces. You trying to scare me? Dunno. Are you afraid? We're just talking, aren't we? You're not about to kill us. Got it right? To be honest, I got tired of the media circus. All the allegations thrown in my face. The bullshit propaganda. Luckily, we can put all that behind us now. Oh, so you couldn't be happier we saved Myers after your botched hit. Right. Think you believe that less than I do. I will let you and Reed walk free of this place. In one piece. On your own two feet. Consider it a gesture of my goodwill. Your little bird came to me on her own, though. She was tired of breaking international laws on the president's whim. She simply had to run away. Breaching the black wall, jeopardizing the net, all humankind's safety in fact for personal gain. I wonder what Netwatch would say. Pass it on to President Myers. Also tell her her toy of mass destruction is my friend now. And she should get the fuck out of my backyard, or the world will learn about her games. I've matters to attend to. You'll find Mr. Reed downstairs. Okay, V. Got all we need. Sheesh. Colossal prick. Hear what he said? Yeah, caught it all. Didn't like it one bit, either. Son of a bitch that I'd find Reed downstairs. Yeah, heard him. Wasn't crazy about his tone. Time to evac me. Best not check the face. Head to the elevator, ride down to once. Need to know what's up with Saul. Thinking about what that prick said. Songbirds are walking, talking WMD. And Hanson's got her on a tight leash. And he can prime her for use whenever he wants. Listen, V. We need to get her out. For everyone's sake. Guy knows. Got some dirt on Myers. Can't imagine it happening. But if the public learns that any U.S. president willingly broke international laws governing cyberspace use... Then USA is fucked. Myers will either have to take the fall, let herself be buried in dirt for this... Or she'll defy the world and spark another war. Fuck me. Oh, just once I'd like to see things go smoothly, as planned. This feels so very, very wrong. You and your chum best be headed the fuck out now. Straight on from here. Gonna walk you two out. Come on, V. No reason to hang. Think you can stand there and bark orders at me? Fuck the fuck off! Um, I'm in, um... Please make your way to the exit. Good time! Nora, we'll be out in moments. No stopping, let's go. Fuck off. Follow me. How'd things go, V? Got everything. All set. You got thorough scans of the runners. Both of them. Yourself. I said, we got everything. Well, well. And then you, uh, excused yourself. Stepped away. Disappeared? Hansen showed up. We chatted. Threats were made, actually. Said if Myers doesn't let up, world will learn about Songbird. About Pierce and the Blackwall. He clearly knows what Somi means to the president. Personal WMD, you mean? Yeah, Hansen knows all. 
Need to get her the fuck out, Reed. Really. I was afraid of this. Okay. P, Alex and I have work. We need to analyze the data from Songbird. Might take a day or two. Prem, open comms line then? Sure. We'll work out a game plan. Get back to you ASAP. Oh, and V, bang up work. I do. Ah, V, you're here. It's about time, too. Nearly done finalizing the plan. Back on the same page, are we? Not exactly. Brings back a lot of memories, all this. One in particular sticks out. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's Not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. What happened in Medellin? What was the up there? We had our sides trained on a guy who sat on the Colombian president's back pocket. Sold him smuggled corp tech. You saying the FIA pulls strings overseas? A lot of what we do doesn't get printed in the norm sheets. Anyway, we used stolen identities on that mission too. Things didn't go exactly as planned, but that's a long story. Think we can spare 60 seconds? Hell, might even learn something about so me that'll prove useful. All right. Our person of interest was one Luis Hernandez, arms trading heavyweight. We aim to plant our own SA in his organization. Alex had adopted the identity of an engineer from Hernandez's entourage. She was our ticket in. She walks in to attend a meeting one day. She sees one of Luis's bikini model girlfriends prancing out on her way to walk his dopamine. Spending big money on Kit's luxury was kind of his M.O. So, what happened? Well, Somi had put together Hernandez's dossier. Problem was, an important detail slipped through the cracks. The engineer's abject fear of dogs. Cold sweat, shaky hands, soggy pant leg, that kind of fear. When the Doberman sniffed Alex's knee, she pats him on the head and says, Who's a good boy? Then, she went to pull up a chair at Hernandez's table. Before she could sit down, they had two barrels to her head and one trained at the base of her spine. What did you do? Well, my hands are bound, got a sack on my head, hear a collapsible baton snap into place, flack. I did what anyone do in that sitch. I lied my fucking ass off. Don't sit quite straight to this day, though. Okay, back to Night City, folks, with our sights trained on a new target. We've parsed the intel from the shards Somi gave him. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want to run. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we... 
Righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here's your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. No, she was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Alex nailed it. If anyone's to blame, it's Myers, not you. You might be right, but so am I. Right, our objective, to free Somi from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue op, because, well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall, a consequence of her service to the NUS and President Might. I'm not about to pretend I understand the tech wise and how. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, the cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. So this neural matrix, how much do we know? Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint US Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter our Asaka soul killer. The Matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the Black Wall, and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you and Songbird. All right. Plan. I'm here. It. Hanson to meet with the Netrunners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close to Song and the Matrix. Hansen hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know its security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hansen access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hansen's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural Matrix is in there too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now we just need to take those twins out of the equation. Hey, Marik and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand. Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. Yeah, buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, because they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hansen. So we kidnap them. How we want to do this? They're driving a rental while in NC, an exploitable opening. We're going to track their ride and hijack it before they reach Hansen at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Alex will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavior imprints are tuned already. And your role in all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your exfil route. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem free. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hansen? Right. Where well, you'll sell him the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Gonna disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Hansen and his goons. Aim to handle them on your own? Can do a lot more than play dress-up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. Sounds like Flatline and Hansen set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the NUS. And Songbird. We have to rescue her. Myers told you as much as hell. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. 
So, time we talked about Nab and the runners? Cover that in a minute. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far. Near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. So breach the station, trace the car. Good. What then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Sounds simple enough. Tech worth tens of thousands can help any plan go off like a dream. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it. B, heads up. I can't talk long, but two things, quickly. First, good news. I managed to upgrade your Relic's firmware. You'll see what I mean in a minute. Don't worry, completely painless. First good news, you said. So there a second thing? Right, it's super important. It stays between us, Skata. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk freely. Okay, need to Delta. We'll see you soon. Great. You got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed soon as you grab that encryption key. Here we are. You and me, face to face. Ah! This spot. Didn't oh. pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Ah! Wanted to show you something. Means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. Ah! And it means I trust you. Ah! Come over here. Ah! So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. Swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it. Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street. I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasted bunk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scoff dogs around. He shit talking one of his tunes. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Yearning in to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you missed something, 
It's usually too late. Attack on Myers. You schemed it up with Anson, I know that. Yeah, Neural Matrix was pricey. But honestly, I... I never thought he'd try to kill her. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself too, almost. Ground the plane. That was the plan. Didn't expect he... Blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix, and for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack, he knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. I fucked everything up. I know V. But I had no choice. Still don't understand why. Was it any other way? Honestly? Wouldn't have resorted to this if there was. From Myers, the NUSA, I'm just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. And weapons and tools? They don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Burden of past mistakes. We both bear it. It ain't easy. Me for the biochip, you for the black wall. You mean to say it's my fault? No, just that when you try to save yourself, it's usually someone else who pays the price. Hmm. Yeah. Ain't that the brutal fucking truth? You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, feel the same way about me don't trust Reed guy wants to save your life mm -hmm. he saved me once already word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk so he knocked on a 19 year old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse join and serve or become a netwatch trophy that girl died that day the person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed, he died too. Just more recently, seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence, yet he serves the country to this day, clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me. The one to ask, actually. What happens exactly, you know, when you reach past the black wall. Know the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life, but it just turns up blank. You mean losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes I... I lose control, or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else, but it feels horrible. Oh, did too, with the Chimera, like a live-in nightmare. Yeah, more and more I get the sense someone's standing behind me, but there's never anyone there. Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah. With you and myself. I 
need to get away. From Kurt, then USA, Reed. From everything. Speaking of, out of everybody out there, you saw Hanson as a trusty ally. Seriously? I needed someone who could tear me from Meyer's grip. I knew him from my time in Night City when I was posted here. Took a steep risk, all right. And a plain gonk one at that. That's why I enlisted you, too. Night City's just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved. Or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. How am I to know this isn't an elaborate con? Be nice to have some kind of guarantee. I can't give you one, sorry. But I've shown you my trust. I mean, you're free to sell me out to Reed, right? Or trust me enough to save us both. No guarantee for either of us. Fair deal, I say. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission, grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then... Uh... You help me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the Matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... that's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? Can't be both. You'd fit right in in D.C. Just enough truth, but not too much. I'll take what I can get. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hanson. So me contacted me. Got news. Let me hear it. Well, first off, we've been greenlit. Our VIP's ready to be served. Music to my ears. What else? Songbird opened up a bit. Better sitch. It's looking bad. Real bad. This tech's her only shot. I hear you. I do. All the more reason to focus on the mission in front of us. Get our hands on that cure. Agreed. What Somi spilled, we really need to talk. I know, but later. Not a topic for the hollow. We need that car tracking, so get to work. We'll go from there. Once you get the encryption key from this system, let me know immediately. Looking for something? Won't find you here. There's nothing to find. Transceiver. Need to jack in quick. Two sucks and I'm gone. You do you. <sighs> Borked. It ain't working? <gasps> Jesus. You want a hint? I can tell you how to fix it if you really want to fix it. Old people need help with this stuff sometimes. So, yeah, turn it off first, then turn it back on. You know, I can tell you where to look for the on button for a thousand ads. Interested? Okay, Eddie's are all yours. Nova, done deal. So, Switch, where is it? I don't know exactly. 
around here. Telling you where to look, not where to find it. Just like I said. We'll play hot and cold. If you're close or far, we'll holler hot or cold. Let's start playing. You'll get it. Warmer. Hot! Yo, yo, yo! Don't even think about flatlining here! I ain't gonna touch a corpse! This... This gotta be what having a fucking stroke feels like. Ugh, this fucking sucks! Preaching to the choir. Hey, you made it. Got a head start. A drink to calm the nerves. You surprised me with the invite. Surprised? Really? Didn't know what to make of it. But yeah, it's nice to press pause once in a while. I wrote you because... Because I needed someone to talk to. Someone outside the firm. And not some total rando. To take my mind off the mission, not worry about being someone else for a millisec. Hope that makes sense. Okay. So, what do you want to talk about? I mean, it's not like I have an agenda typed up. I just want to be a normal fucking person for a little bit. Myself, specifically. Just me. Just Alex. I like the sound of that myself. Just shed this skin and leave the Night City Merc behind. Hey, yeah. Like, who are you anyway? <laughs> good question. With all the shit going on in my life lately, a damn good question. And definitely too soon to know for sure. Say, you ever think about who you'd be now if, you know, life had taken a different turn? I don't know. I guess. I'd still be searching, taking it one day at a time, making mistakes along the way. Getting tangled up in trouble, you mean? No doubt. But maybe the kind not out to kill me. Okay, now you. Who would you be, if not a secret agent and master of disguise? An actor. No hesitation there. Always dreamed of seeing my face on a show bill. I love musicals especially. Seriously? Call me old-fashioned. So yeah, guess I'd be a brain dance star. Hmm. <laughs> What's so special about musicals? The world in song is much more beautiful than in reality. Intensely so. Plus, I just like to dance. to your future career. I know you can pull it off. Thanks, V. Really. Ooh, 
I love this song. Never know in which ways up down. It's never what it seems when it's all I'm ever missing. And it feels as though I'm waiting. And I don't need no head in my hands To know I'm ever heading way south Don't do this often, I'm guessing. Busted moves? I can't say I do. What gave it away? <laughs> Wasn't thinking of dancing, but never mind. see you on BD posters in no time. I know it. First, retirement. See you soon, V. As you were saying. Hey, I got the encryption key for Karen Exotics. Nice work. V, one other thing. We need new chrome. An implant that accommodates behavioral imprints. I'm sending you deets for a clinic. The doc will be expecting you. Just tell the Ripper you know she collects unification war trinkets. She know you came with my blessing. You Farida? Yes, and we're closed. Got something might interest you? I doubt it. Here you collect trinkets. Unification war era. Mm-hmm. Come in. I'm sorry I was unwelcoming. Ever since a certain space plane crashed nearby, I've had to be more cautious. V, good to see you. <laughs> Here to see me? Things are in flux. Situation's changing faster. I thought we should talk. I'm here about Somi. I spent hours wrapping my head around this. Putting myself in her shoes. I needed to understand what she must have been going through too. To resort to treason. You're in no position to understand, Reed. Your life ain't on a timer. But I know death. Stared him in the eyes up close. She's trapped. Not just here and now, but going months back. Hell. Actually years. I blame Myers, a sore loser. Does her damnedest to avoid it. Songbird, the black wall, dirty tricks meant to give her a competitive edge. It's no wonder Somi doesn't trust anyone, except maybe you, a little. There's a prison cell prepped and waiting for her already. Somi knows that full well. 
She lives to see tomorrow and every day after. That's what matters. Myers needs her alive, sure, but forgive and forget the attempt on her life? Never. Myers might not forgive her, but doesn't mean I can. You forgetting? Woman tried to zero you, too. Her hand's been forced too many times in her life. She's due compensation. Okay. We break the chain Hanson wrapped around her neck. Then what? We stow away somewhere safe. Ask some questions. Establish some common ground. Once I get the answers I'm looking for, I'll personally help her disappear. From everyone, everywhere. Including Myers. Wanna ask her a few questions, huh? To understand her side. Got an idea already of what I'll hear. System broke her. Almost took her life. Like it did mine. As for me, well, my time's well past. But Somi's still worth saving. Spinning quite the yarn playing me. Fits the M.O. of someone who used to recruit spies for a living. Fuck! No! Just listen. I got contacts in Europe. We'll find the best clinic, put you two back together, fix what's broken. Once we have your cure in hand. But I need to help Somi first. She's lost, and I'm concerned she doesn't know what she's doing. You don't trust her? What I don't trust is the shit from beyond the black hole and the attendant paranoia. Both in play here, I'm afraid. She has another plan in mind. I'm damn sure of it. So me... She reached out. Wasn't telling the whole truth before. Once out, off the grid. Has it planned for right after we take down Hanson. Gonna make a run for it. Slip out of Night City. I... Thank you, V, for your candor. This means a lot to me. I have something for you. Our best minds in D.C. cooked it up. Icebreaker. Silver bullet against any fortified netrunner. Farida will feed it into your system during surgery. Use that, and Somi will drop unconscious within a minute. We can't take any chances, and when she wakes up, she'll wake up at home. She could sense the breaker. Not talking about some run-of-the-mill runner here. It's meta-heuristic, hyper-aggressive tech, cobbled together by a literal army of experts. If she does sense it, it won't matter. No one out there, alone, could withstand something like this. Okay, how do I use it? Fire it up when you're both jacked into the mainframe. At that moment, Somi's door will be wide open. Two of you could just, you know, sit down, talk it out. That's my aim, precisely. After you kidnap her. Not quite the same. We've come to a point where some options are simply off the table. Right now, we're focusing on saving your lives. Talking time will come later. It's time I was on my way. I leave you in Farida's able hands. Call me once you're done here. The sooner we begin, the sooner we finish. I need to do anything, or...? Twenty questions first. Should I hold your hand? No. Do nothing. Tush, meet chair. Okay. Anesthesia incoming. Don't worry, it's the good stuff. Relax and submit. An ID modding implant is complicated tech, true. But the procedure is surprisingly simple. This tech... I actually heard about it. Back at our Osaka counter intel. We thought it got the chop at the prototype stage. As you can see, it yet lives. Chatterbox. Okay. Anesthesia is taking hold.
How many fingers am I holding up? Oh no, Johnny. Fuck off, please. You missed me. Warms the cockles. Truly. So tell me, what's it feel like to be a traitor? Come on. You know this is a lose-lose clusterfuck of a sitch. I ain't here by choice. At least you see that. Means they haven't turned you yet. Not completely. Come on, got iron in your hand. Gotta put it to someone's head. Pull the trigger. The master spy and the agent unloosed. Tragedy, comedy, or both. Think one of them's trying to dupe me? No, they're both telling the truth. I mean, might be muddy on the nitty gritty, but their motivations are plain and clear. Survival. It's her be all and end all. That, and she's a walking, talking nuke. The kind that keeps making mistakes, never knowing which one's gonna set her off. And Reed? Bastard and me are one and the same. If I hadn't ghosted the army, I'd have become a Reed myself. Live and die by our principles. That's the tragedy, V. Someone's gonna play victim to the other's good intentions. Try not to forget that when you're standing over that fucking overgrown neuro drive. Reed? Or Songbird? What would you do in my shoes, Johnny? I am in your shoes, dumbass. For every gonk choice you make. But I can't do dick. But honest to God, V, not fucking around? I don't know. Got no goddamn clue. Well done. The facial morph implant is online. Now all you need is a behavioral imprint. And do me a favor. Don't tell me what you need this for. Might pop by if I need anything else. I can't wait. Hey, procedure's a wrap. V. I hope you're not feeling too raw post for Rita's work. It's time to intercept and supplant the Netrunners. Just one hiccup. Our access to Karen Exotics was cut. They must have discovered us. Wait, seriously? So we lost them? Not entirely. We know they were last in the city center. Headed out direction. Find a vantage point near the entrance of Dogtown. You'll grab a trace on the runners as they drive to the meeting. No visual on our targets. See a convoy. Hanson's goons. Doubt the runners would have a security escort, though. I'll keep watching. Additional support for the stadium, most likely. No visual on our targets. Couple of bikers. Don't expect they'd swap out four wheels for two last minute. Nah, not this style. On to the next. There they are. No question. Both runners are inside. Got the signal? Got it. Not gonna slip off our radar anymore. Good work. Still early for the meet with Hansen. 
They'll stop. Kill time somewhere. Okay, they're stationary. And out of the car. Walking towards the club now. V, you're clear to head for the car. Get to it. Are you in position? Here we are. Damn. Free ride. Hey, you're not there at the window shop. Smooth sailing so far. Car's cam feeds are mine. Good. Last check now. Make sure you're ready to roll. Should be good. Just give me one sec. Why? What are you doing? Tweaking the ice. Kind of half-baked way it's set up now. Fine. Just no unnecessary risks. And done. Not bad. Now we wait. Our VIPs are back. They're about to get in. Time to focus up. Kurt Hansen, tu l'as vu, non? Il était grave en train de me relooker au Saphir. À moins que ce soit cette putain de gueule de bois. Oh, ça tourne de partout, dans tous les sens. T'en penses quoi De Hanson, je veux dire. Ok, V, take control. Hold on. He's dropping a bit. Could get interesting. Oh, il a foutu le feu au cul de tout le monde quand il a abattu cet avion. Le risque est élevé, oui. Mais ce travail paye bien. On fait notre part. Ensuite, on disparaît. Oh, putain de gueule de bois de sa mère. Il a fallu que tu fasses ça aujourd'hui. Je t'avais dit de pas ouvrir cette dernière bouteille. Oui, hey, you copy. Chill, just wait. T'en penses quoi De Hansen, je veux dire et Je l'ai vu parler au chef de la police et lui donner une petite tape sur la joue comme un chiot. L'autre n'a pas branché. Et il m'en fallait pas plus pour cerner le personnage. C'est un enfoiré coriace et un homme dur. Il survivra à tout ce qui lui balance mon. Mmh, ouais, dur, juste comme je les aime. Ils ont de l'endurance qui va avec. La voiture, quelqu'un en a pris le contrôle. Fabrique, sonne l'alarme. On a besoin d'aide. Je vais localiser le vecteur. Ok, une seconde. C'est fait Putain, allez J'essaie de reprendre le contrôle On est coupé Mais merde Quoi Putain, qu'est-ce que Non, non, non think we'd do? Bind their hands with duct tape, shove socks in their mouths, and wait for them to wriggle free and call for help? This ain't no game, V. It's a simple choice. Them or us. I chose us. It's a game! Your fucking spy game! They weren't playing! They were innocent! That's not quite how I describe two pro criminals. These innocents, as you call them, wouldn't hesitate to rob you for everything you've got. Or put a bullet in your back.
All right, we have fresh disguises already, but you still need to lift the access codes off them. Aurora's the one to check for those. <sighs> this feels so fucked up. Expect me to believe you've never taken anything off a body before? Alex, you knew about this. this execution. Of course I knew. Textbook move. Not exactly my first mission, V. Call like that comes with the territory. All right, code's transferred. Taking the wheel. V, behave your imprint now. Check, check. Oh shit, my voice! <laughs> nice! Hang on, that's me? What the hell? Cream, right? Give it a whirl. Introduce yourself. Huh. A little miracle must do more than morph your face and voice. Gotta fuck with your hormones like a designer drug. Give you hyper-specific highs and lows to change your behavior. Mm -hmm. Establishes a new baseline. You just gotta say the right words. Okay, here goes. Aurore Cassel. Who the fuck is asking? Hmm, not bad. It can feel like a real trip at first, but you'll get used to it. And take a sec, collect yourself, then we move. Hansen's waiting. Alex, it just hit me. This'll be our last stop together. I haven't forgotten our deal. I is green it. A diplomatic mission. No end date. Call it early retirement. Thanks much, Reed. Okay, let's get to it. Alright, stadium then. See you there. a little refresher before we arrive. Remember, name's Aurore Cassel. Let me let you in on my secret about how to be someone else. Ask yourself three questions. What do they fear? What do they want? What's their deepest secret? Got that? Don't answer now, just something to keep in mind. And be her. So, Aurore, your thoughts on Hansen? Tell me. Oh la la, the bastard is king of his realm. He is too big, too strong to be removed. Not by the powers in Night City, not by the NUS. The locals think, ah, fuck it, he's okay. And the NUSA? Impotent. It cannot challenge Night City over one man and broken buildings. Man, couldn't agree more. Plus, I like his massive balls. <laughs> not a metaphor the actual coconuts in his pants. Uncanny and disturbing. Spot on or Good work. We have arrived. The hound's den. Stop your vehicle. Prepare to have it inspected. You are good. Come on through. Before we go in, remember, he wants something from us, not the other way around. 
We are here to sell him Sinoshore mainframe access codes. Stick to the facts. Know who you are and are not. We are here. Don't lose your goats, Emmerich. We have a meeting with Colonel Hansen. Checking now, need a sec? Good, you made it. We haven't met yet. Name's Murphy. Goodness, Murphy, your nerves are spent. Such tense shoulders. Tense? <laughs> no, no, never better. Oh, a relief. How silly it would be for an impressive specimen such as you to worry. Right. Oh, let's finish this quickly. My hangover is killing me. So, Songbird told me a little about you. Said you two hail from Europe. That's right. And... Did you enjoy yourselves at the Sapphire? Police commissioner, a candidate for mayor, the Tiger Claws bookkeeper. All gambling on the city's future together. Figuratively, and not. The anatomy of corruption is beautiful here. Uh, uh, yeah. Took the words right out of my mouth. Okay, here's our stop. You should expect to have eyes on you all day today. Kurt got a tip. The FIA plans to pull some gonk move. Situation's under control. He ordered everyone checked out, though. No exceptions. Many wish your colonel dead. He must be vigilant. Got our people manning the whole stadium. Drone-aided scans providing surveillance support, too. Need you to leave your weapons here. Next, we'll need to run some ID scans. Joke around as we might, get along as we do. Ultimately, this is a place of serious business. You understand. This here is the heart of our little empire. Ah, how you sell these war machines? It's like a car salesman? Kinda, <laughs> yeah. But wholesale only. Suppose you're a dictator from some rinky-dink country. I don't know. Australia, let's say. Tanks, choppers, subs. You want it, we got it. No red tape. You have submarines! Fresh out. But we sure did. All right, I'm in position. Prepare an IEVAC route now. Take your time. I need ten more minutes at least. Not much further now. I couldn't get started earlier without risk of being compromised. And the raw? It should go without saying. But stay in character. Good luck. Have this you been way. Have since the beginning? Since the op in Night City, you mean? You could say that. But we served together earlier, too. I see. Then he must trust you very much. A pleasure to see you both. Songbird needs a moment to disarm the device. Which gives us a chance to chat. Murphy told us some shit at the fan. That bogeyman know of us here, of our meeting. We expect it all to be handled professionally. Murphy exaggerates, and he spoke out of turn. We have only suspicions, but I assure you, caution is our creed. Oh, Colonel Kurt, you're too tense. I exaggerate. 
I wished only to see your reaction. <laughs> Are you testing me? No, no, no. We checked you before. Now I just tease. This means I like you, no? <laughs> Fuck your entertaining. We could pretend to trust each other, or we could focus on business. A pragmatist, to my taste. Agreed. I'd like to raise a little toast to a successful day of business. Don't worry about the work, Colonel. Just your health. I must decline. Your loss, little brother. It's changing the subject. Did you enjoy yourselves at the Sapphire? My people tell me the stakes went high. You two left richer and happier, I hope. I thought it a night at a casino. Wine and cash until both ran out. But then, this new piece of ass joined our table. Another one. Thanks to them, winner, winner, chicken dinner. The Black Sapphire. My pride and joy. I worked hard to make it the go-to destination for Night City's royalty. Oh, actually, before I forget, I learned recently that we have a mutual friend. She said you did time together at La Sante. Remembers you well. My, you must have an impressive set of contacts, Colonel. And just who is this friend who remembers me so well? Raquel. Asked me to say hello. She did her time under Max Security, C Block. Said her rat tattoo might jog your memory. <laughs> this Raquel is clearly mistaken. Max security is separate from the VIP wing where I stayed. <laughs> Thank God. Ah, it must have been someone like you. Very much like you. Indeed. How many years have you been in Night City? They say you served with Militech once. Seven years now. And yes, before that it was my mission to plant an NUS flag on this soil. Then it appears to be a great success. The things you have achieved here. Impressive. That flag's a piss-soaked pile of ash now. What I built, I built with my own two hands, for me. Why did you change sides? Because I don't need a convenient ideology to hide my business behind. I tossed the flag, but the suits in DC still remember me. President Myers, too? She called just six months ago, in fact. Asked me to help with a mess she couldn't clean up herself. Bureaucracy, red tape, and all that. Interesting. And, uh, she calls, still? Not lately. Her administration recently encountered some, uh, turbulence along its path. Ah, by the way, at the Sapphire, you asked me to contact a certain fashion type. Remind me who? Oh, the tailor of Kerry Eurodyne. Oh, he is so flavorful. Mm, I must have a taste. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, that's the one. The fashion world isn't exactly my forte, so I'll need maybe a week to arrange it. Your sister certainly is the more talkative of you two. You noticed? You compliment each other well. Listen, it seems we've got time to spare. There's another opportunity I'd like to discuss. An expansion into Western Europe. What I need is a reliable partner on the ground. Two would be even better. Hey. Relax, soldier. Hey, you know, Kurt, the arms trade. <laughs> we keep our fingers out of this cookie jar. I see. But all I need is a nudge in the right direction. Some introductions, a little intelligence, one-time request. Say, 200,000? 
Mmm, now I have butterflies. I need an inn with Les Collectifs. I'm sorry, Colonel, but you are teasing the wrong cock. Am I? But you're famous in Paris. You must have a connection. Le Collectif and we um, have a history. Like you and your NUSA, we do not uh, make love. No fucking love at all. Uh -huh. I see. And appreciate both the honesty and the metaphor. Ah, so me. We can begin. The mainframe is ready. You remember the terms. One of you feeds in the access codes, the other stays with me. I will stay. Shall we? Follow me. So tell me, how do you like NC now that you're back? This one of... While you are waiting, I ran some initial diagnostics. The mainframe is prepped and linked with our systems. She's ready to go. You know, he created this lab especially for the occasion. Tens of millions of eddies invested for your visit alone. That's Kurt for you. I have a plan in place for when we secure the neural matrix. I'll hack the local net, override its defense systems, turn the whole stadium hostile. We'll slip out in the chaos. But... How many would die? Stand clear, They'll please. Die You're blocking so me. We can survive. Live. I managed to simulate the mainframe's native environment. The bunker. It'll be ready for the access codes in a moment. Listen, V. All hell breaks lose in two minutes. When Hanson flatlines, we haul ass. I'll block access to this room. Alex and Reed are minimizing risk and exfilling early via the route. Here she is. In all her glory. Oh, and don't worry about us. Got that sorted already. Check stadium blueprints. No which way to run. So, shall we? No turning back now. No. But we're in this together. Ready. Linked. Is the connection clear? Thousandth of the decimal. It'll have to do. Time to get wet. Actuating the mainframe. Hansen suspects something. Just hasn't caught on yet. Soon it won't matter. Mm, I see. It's responding. Stay sharp. Almost open for input. Big thank you. Really. Thank you for being here. Just... a little... more... Okay, your turn. It's ready for the access codes. I'm with you, Somi. Look toward Alex. Wait for Kurt to go down. Can do. What then? We run. Nearly have the Matrix. Breaching stadium defenses now. It's... a lot. Had to reach past the black wall. Wait, you mean to say, like, the whole stadium? Cutting off the lab now? Carving a path out of here. Defense systems are nearly primed to turn on Kurt's forces. Let Alex know. Mm-hmm. Target down. It's done.
Stadium defenses, hostile and online. Okay, you got it. Everything all right? Tommy, you okay? What's wrong? The Matrix, the, the stadium, the black wall. Just lost control for a second. But, yeah, I'm okay now. V, you need to bolt. Things get dicey. I can help. Pack stuff around you. Just can't push myself. Mainframe breach. Black wall hit me hard. Disable the door. We have a moment to catch our breath. Sitting from the back of the stadium. I've arranged two cars. En route already. One's for you, the other's for me. Should make us harder to track. I feel it. Light. It's not budging. <sighs> What's this? Okay. Jump in. I think I see uh, them that alarms for. Uh, Last? Gotta be them. Fuck! Fucking ankle! Handsome Come on, dog Sony. Could swoop in Final any stretch. Sack. Toward the gate. Carl be there. Thank you, V. You're gonna make it out of this? If I don't, you'll hear about it on the news. So me, we... We did it. Got away. From Hanson and the FIA. Not quite, V. This was the first step. I won't rest easy until I'm out of NC airspace. Seriously? Gonna hop on another plane after how you wound up here? You'll see. Hope you got a plan for what comes next. We need to split up. Try to throw off the agency's pursuit strategy. 
Meanwhile, I'll confirm my path out of Night City is clear. Once I do, I'll be in touch. Where are we gonna meet? And when? I'll send you the coordinates. Just wait for my sig. And don't get caught. Hey, likewise. And V? Thanks. district are you hey yeah we should talk face to face could it be a gig coming my way far better i see a blank page in night city's chronicle your name is on it the page and i await at the heavy hearts my my aren't we confident today last. I lacked the time to brew tea. My apologies. Face to face again? What's changed? Everything. And that's what we'll discuss. Kurt Hansen. A man of many hats. A criminal, dog of war. To mine eye, an entrepreneur. And business suffocates in a vacuum. Vultures circle the Colonel's corpse already. The enterprise he built must choose a new leader. We will make certain they choose correctly. The Shard, please insert it. Uh-huh, and why is it we care? I take the long view of Dogtown's well-being. You care for short-term profit. Should Dogtown drown in blood, neither is achievable. Let me guess. Got a successor all lined up, don't you? Lieutenant Colonel Bennett, one of Hanson's most loyal, commands respect, is capable of rallying a strong base. The logical choice, this gentleman soldier. Alas, he has competition. A man named Yago. He's starting from a lower rung, but has high aspirations. He's already begun seeking outside support from the Voodoo Boys. You will meet with Yago. You will convince him to back down. What's Bennett's story? Ex-Marine took part in Operation Midnight Storm. He never questioned orders, didn't serve for glory or medals. Loyal from start to finish. Yago not up to snuff? Why? He's an accountant. No soldier. Kept Hansen's books for him. V. You don't win hearts by counting numbers. Okay, I'll handle that. No, you won't. But Aguilar will. Uh, you lost me. Hansen remained on top because he had the contacts to stay afloat. Most important among them was a Cuban cartel. Enter Aguilar, a merc assassin from Havana. A living legend. Every time someone in Havana lights a cigar, Aguilar extinguishes a life somewhere around the globe. I'm lucky to have her behavioral imprint on hand. You're lucky to have experience with the tech already. Merc assassin, huh? Color me curious. Anything else I ought to know? Real name, unknown. Body count, unknown. Conservative estimates put it in the dozens. Per continent. Rumors, perhaps. But rumors often make for crowning arguments in negotiation. Let me summarize. Need me to assume Aguilar's identity? Have a chat with Yago. Talk him out of any silly ideas he might have. Child's play. Okay. 
All's crystal. I prepared a shard with helpful intelligence. Also a weapon. The same Aguilar uses. Help yourself to both. Interesting piece of iron. Custom made. A unique and highly persuasive tool. <laughs> Time to kick the tires, V. Suit up and take the imprint for a whirl. Do you feel the difference? Seriously, Hans? You make me your guinea pig for untested tech? Thought you valued your well-being more than that. Hmm. Better than expected, V. Or rather, Aguilar. You'll make a strong impression on Yago too. A trusted source tells me he's to meet soon with a delegation of the Dogtown Voodoo's. <gasps> I'll forward the coordinates. I care not at all for how you handle the Gangoons. <laughs> As you will. I have only one request. Yago withdraws his candidacy. Once you've shown him reason, call me. And remember, my district's future is riding on this. Dogtown's future and yours. Don't fuck me over, Hans. <laughs> Rehearsing, are you? Close. Just a bit lacking. Good luck. Côté isolé. Gago ça, c'est un petit chat, oui donc. Comme il t'a doué, ça paye un petit risque. Pour lui-même. Probably not a good time to take Aguilar for a walk. Si contre ça a marché, Dogtown c'est pour nous. Scarvio a plus de petits cacaillons nous pour l'occuper vite. Protéger tête nous! Gotta wait for the man. Out in the open. Ah, want a face off, do you? Aguilar, you saucy senorita. There they are. Gonk's got no clue what's coming. Think I'm gonna shed a tear. Something ain't right, boss. And you are... I answer with my own question. Do you know what happens when someone in Havana lights a cigar? Somewhere in the world, Aguilar takes a life. So they say. Do you know what else they say? That you have angered the wrong people. We know of your plan to oust Bennett. We know of your new allies. The Voodoo Boys? Poor choice. My superiors follow Christ, Yago. I... I never intended any disrespect. What happens now? The chain of command. It is a concept you know. If just one link fails, the chain breaks. You will lay your ambitions to rest. You will resume your place in the chain and hold firm. Charlie! Think you're hot shit. Prove it. Oh shit. No, no. You... Uh, so the legends are true. Point taken. I'll back down. But there's something you should know. Bennett is Arasaka's pawn. They aim to control Dogtown through him. You have proof of Bennett's deception, I trust. Know where to find it. He goes to the city center often, Republic Way. The building's a front, occupied by a dummy corp owned by Arasaka. As to Bennett's biz there, ask him. 
Press him. You'll see him, right? Plot thickens. Once they're gone, uncloak for your face melts like Scott Chaco. Just getting started, Johnny. Guess you ought to keep hands in the loop. Or we could see what his favorite son's cooking up with fucking Arasaka. After all, Dogtown's future hangs in the balance. Well played, Aguilar. High five me on Monarch Obana. What the hell you want, Reed? You're a disappointment, V. To me, to some. We could have helped her. We, together. It was her choice, Saul. You're helping a traitor who took a potentially lethal swipe at the NUS president's life. Sheesh. Song just wants to fly free, man. Leave her alone. No more tragedies, I promise. V, this isn't something you and I can settle anymore. Songbird's gone to war. Taken on our own country. We, the FIA, we're gonna find you too. You have exactly nowhere to run, V. Forget already. Us fleeing, leaving you in the dirt. True. I don't have eyes on you, but we'll see each other soon. Oh, yes, we will. And I'll expect you to mend your ways then. Calling your bluff, Reed. Seriously doubt FIA will find us. Says a minor league merc with a sick woman to babysit and drag along his baggage. Arrogance can be blinding. You can't see you're hours away from getting caught in a serious bind. When that same arrogance will tell you to fight, die. Remember then, it won't be just your life on the line. Somi's life will also be on your head held high in the face of death. Nighttime Aguilar had a word with Bennett. This is Kentown. This is intelligence. Ain't our guy that. Probably his hustle. Take him out now, just in case. Save yourself the headache later. Ah! Tell you what Aguilar do. Dump the body, stack. Then wait for Bennett in the ride. Get the jump on. same page. They agreed to back me. Two unmarked tactical units in Dogtown. Gordon, let's roll. But what a grind. Japanese suits have their neckties tied sup. Wait, who? Oh fuck, Aguilar! So you know now how the Japanese tie their neckties. Do you know the Colombian way? The Colombians cut open your neck, pull your tongue out through the hole. It sounds complicated, but I've had plenty of practice. Aguilar, please listen to me. I know what this must look like. This fuckhead Yago. Your accountant. Hmm. He's trying to cut me out. Arasaka's promised to have my back. All they want in exchange is access to our smuggling routes. No. What they seek is control of your smuggling routes. Only a fool would think otherwise. I'm out to secure the future. For my organization, 
for your bosses. You will put Arasaka behind you, Bennett. Why? Because you are in a car with Havana, while Tokyo is somewhere out there. This is a geography lesson? Fucking joke! Oh, Bennett. What little regard you have for your own life. What do you get when you take steaming? You won't let it go. Is that it? Well, fine. Your legend hands hit! <laughs> Do you want the throne? It is mine to give, but to a soldier, not a corporate puppet. If I see even one Arasaka shadow in Docktown, I will return and find you. But without my friendly demeanor. Is that clear? Yes, Aguilar. Understood. Dream work, Aguilar. Time for a breather, though. V, have you made progress? Has Yago reconsidered? Has indeed. Also, Voodoo Boys are out of the equation. Splendid. Have you anything else to add? Yup. Not with Bennett, too. Man's a sock puppet. Sock his hand up his ass. Don't worry. I pulled him off, ironed him out. For good, I hope. Huh. It's not something I asked you to do. But I do appreciate it. Bennett is still superior to Yago as a candidate. What now? Time to pay tribute to the Fallen. Aguilar will attend Hansen's funeral service and ensure a smooth transfer of power. Uh-huh. Sounds like you expect trouble. Such events can trigger geysers of raw emotion. No two people grieve alike, and rarely rationally. Ceremony and Wake both at the Black Sapphire. Aguilar should enter without a hitch. Got it. Le Roi et more. Vive Le Roi. Good luck, V. Hey, V. Ready for this? Don't sound so hot. You sure you're all right? Quite. It is what it is. Okay. Should I be worried? <sighs> Won't help if you do. Just do your part. Grab us a ride. I'm parked. I'm sending you the cords. Join you soon. are going seeing dark spots it's hard to breathe want to flee condition you're in won't get far where the hell'd you go what'd you do came as fast as I could pain made it seem like forever to me Anything specific keep you? So, yeah. Talk to Reed. Huh. And? 
Stubborn old bastard, Reed. Poke long enough, you could drill a hole. Anything new? Anything at all? A bit of lecture and a few FIA-backed threats thrown in. You know the drill. Ah, negotiating by the book. That's what everybody at the firm called it. Think Reed cares about you, truly. Has a use for me, maybe. But one use only. To feel good about himself. What he's doing. So young, yet so jaded. You're so tiny, said the Picobot to the Nanomech. <sighs> Let's roll. Seems you've got a plan after all. To help us both. I do. And it relies heavily, if not wholly, on you. Black Clinic, remember? It's on Luna. Got a flight all lined up to get me there. Uh, wanna go with you? No, V. Impossible. One and only one. It's all they're expecting. And it's just not open to negotiation. In all likelihood, I'll serve as their lab rat once there. AI's within the neural matrix. They're going to extract it. Create a prototype cure for us. I'll contact you. As soon as they're ready for us both. I promise. Well, be awaiting word. So, spaceflight means spaceport. NCX. It's where we're heading. Now, I can't just stride in. I draw attention from who knows who in my condition. So you'll stride in. Then head to the Tycho Terminal. Find a side door to open for me. What about spaceport security? Tycho Terminal's being renovated. So not many bodies. Lots of cover. Also minimal security, probably. Can't ignore that factor. Think I can manage. Use the time well to rest. I'll try. But let me know if you need me to link up at the net. All this shit's too much. Damn, V. I've wronged so many. Hurt so many. Can't help wondering if it's even avoidable. You know? Hurting others? Dunno. I don't know either. Boots are feet. I relax. Read. Okay. V. Yeah. I don't want to die. Can't help but regret. I just... Help me... Ditch this town. Meds are kicking in. You're all right. We shouldn't linger. Grab the wheel. Could you? Let me scan you. Need to know how you're doing. The state you're in. Whatever you want. Hmm. Shit. This isn't right. Degen's fast. Too fast for any known pathogen. Metastasis spreading straight from the brain. Try and rest up. Don't waste your money on counseling. Only Mr. Stark can save your marriage. Steal yourself. We'll be pulling in. 
Thinking back to that first contact you made. We've come a long way. Obviously, you can't be packing when you go in. Standard spaceport security. Leave your iron with me. I'll have it when we meet up again. Maybe I mask up. I mean, Reed does know my face. If I tag you by the tech sig as you went through security, it's their gear. They'd finger it anywhere. Oh, fuck. Flashback coming in hard. Gone Becky Plaza iced. Banish that shit. You're better than you were. Armed or not, you'll manage. So again, Tycho Terminal. Get there unnoticed by anyone who matters. Eyes peeled for orbital air guards especially. We can't know what they'll be watching for. Join up soon. Orbital Air welcomes you to NCX, Night City International and Translunar. You certainly can't fly. Orbital Air welcomes you to NCX. Night City International and Transit. Interstellar clear bogus. Ganic and Cyber. Just stay calm, sir. I firmly protest. Scans You've no good. right to power down Over my there. implants. Implants. The Mr. Stud does not qualify as a weapon. Welcome to Night City International and Translunar. Your gateway to the world and the stars. I need to temporarily power down any unauthorized implants, personal link, and the panel piece. And use of mind-altering substances is prohibited on these premises. Rain, of course. Be chill. Draw no attention. Implant power down complete. For biometric ID authentication, please look at the camera. Wait! Don't yet! Buy me some time. Need to link your metrics to a fake profile. Uh, which cam would that be? That one. I'm not sure what you want me to do. Look at the camera, please. It'll be over in a few seconds. All set. Go ahead. Do it. Scans all good. Over to there. Thanks. Okay. Now you need to let me in. I couldn't take a terminal. Go. And draw absolutely no eyes. Opening ceremony. Friend left the gift for us. In a case of a luggage conveyor. Grab it. Sending you the combo. Or bud uniform? You got it. And just like that, always security peeps should look right past you. Just remember, cams and bots aren't as easily duped. Okay, need you to find in a quiet corner. Hop in those rags unnoticed. Okay, restroom. Got an open ventilation shaft. Right. Connect straight to the Maglev train tunnel. Oh, well, well. Regulations stipulate that all implants must be deactivated before entering the main terminal building. Thank you for your cooperation. Okay. Train's running, though. That tunnel's an option. Living fast enough? I 
got FIA agents on the Owen. They breached. <sighs> Close. Never again. Yeah, trains can be royal pricks. Tyco terminal now. Where do I go for that? Side or back door? Minor clusterfuck. Forget back and side doors. We need a new plan. What the hell's up, Song? I had to skedaddle. Orbital security started sniffing around the van. God damn it. Got it. Let's try the roof. Construction site elevator. Roger. Find it. What? Where now? Now we get creative. Need deeds. I managed to reach the roof. Lower bit though. Need your help to climb higher and join you. Shape you are in? Can't possibly hope to walk a high wire. It's 120... 30 feet. Doable. Better look around. Move it, B. Scan the roof for something. Rain's pouring. <sighs> Pharaohs. So me. Got an idea. Catch, Song. Let me know when you're ready. Got it. Grip it tight. Just a little more! <laughs> Fuck! No, no, no! Gotcha! You're here. Here. Too fucking close. Next time? Just shouldn't be a next time. Not like this. V? V? What's with you? You know, barely clinging on to life. Both of us. I'm sorry. Stop it. It'll be over soon. Thanks in no small part to you. Your weapons. No gun, no fun. Hold up. What is it? Catching a radio sick. Shit. Encrypted channel. Can you breach? Listen in. Giving it a shot. Let's move on. By the way, great work downstairs. Flitted through like a super spy ghost. Full pro. Had pro support. Frequency. Myers. Incoming. 45 seconds. No more. In here. Quick. Fuck me. FIA will find us. Reed said so. Hasn't yet. Let's keep it that way. Fuck. She's on board. They're gonna land. Get it open. Sony, get inside! Through. And U.S. combat choppers buzzing the free city of NC. Shit's heating up. NCX is not technically part of NC. X territory. Neutral zone. This is Myers basically blowing off international law and agreements. Got a light ahead. Security. Hold up a sec. Moved on. Alert now. Eyes and ears. Shit. Madam President. Special Agent Reed. 
We've confirmed V's presence here in NCX. FIA must have been on you since you went through security. What's up, Tommy? Move. Go. They're gonna spot us. Probably too weak to get around on her own. Most likely she's waiting somewhere. Concealed. Most likely just doesn't cut it. Does Orbital Air know the stakes? They triggered the alarm but failed to find V. And our agents? Cover's been blown on a handful. OA won't get a word out of them. I guarantee it. Those still undercover are looking for Songbird. We'll talk about operational errors later. Asking for help never was your strong suit. So I decided for you and brought support. I have everything under control. No, Saul. You lost control way back. It's time you acknowledge that. Ah, oh, Rosalind Myers. Her true face. Fuck the one on her billboards. care about the girl. Like her. You recruited her, trained her. I get that you want to protect her, but your duty, first and foremost, is to your country. Songbird made her choice. Now she needs to learn what the consequences are. There's one more thing, Saul. The project she was part of stays well under wraps. None of it leaks. This is bad. Really bad. If our little bird lands in the wrong hands, I don't want to think what will happen. All that. We're the only ones privy. It would destroy the NUS. It's not a risk I'm willing to take. We're on the same page. No risks. That's how it'll be. Do you hear that? Just so you know, this isn't any easier for me, Reed. I liked the girl, trusted her. But with some choices, there's no way back. Choices? Yours or hers? Say again? You heard me. But no matter. I know what I have to do and I'll do it. If I authorize you to take any and all necessary action, just try not to shoot her in the head. Might have expected as much. You heard it. Yes, sir. We are fucked. Every which way possible. Relax. I'm here and staying. They're not getting you. You don't know her. I mean, to satisfy her lust for revenge, she'd pull me out of hell. Let's go, still. Civilians are being evacuated. Uh -huh. Prepping to blow in here with all they got. Okay. Back to the terminal now. Need to delta through fast, before all hell breaks loose. Train right to the launch pad, that's all. Just need to blast to the Tycho terminal first. Shit show starting. Then USA versus Old Lamar. Let the fuckers bleed each other out. Getting in range!
too close. Shit. Thought they spotted us. V, if that chopper gets a lock on us, we'll be as good as dead. You are damnedest to avoid it then. No peeps. Oh, the spinning hang for a sec. Could take a look at your chrome. Is that even safe? Most of your sub-assemblies, I'm familiar. Could run auto-diagnostics, grant you access to your bios. Got a readout. I can overclock the compensators. Hope they can take it. It was gonna be different, all this. Smoother. But... the goal's what counts, right? Not far off. So, unscheduled flight to Luna. How much these days? A convo including a few secrets. Hmm. Of the state variety? State variety, personal variety. In my case, unified. Blackwell. That the issue? Hmm. And other things. Rather not talk about it. Just... Don't judge me, okay? So me, I get it. You can get why. You're managing famously. For an extreme egotist? Forget about it. Let's get our shit together. Come on. Help me out, can you? Back at Arasaka, around the water cooler, there was talk about secret corp clinics in orbit. Illegal labs producing prototype weapons, experimental alt meds. Laws prevent you from doing something on Earth, or you pursue it in outer space. Hmm. Looking a little better. You mean that? Shit! Watch out! Find cover now! Out in the open here! Need to move fast! I'm moving! Feel any pain? Would it make any difference? These dick wipes will not let up. Dying in the line of duty then. Control tower now, V. I'll bring a train in. Take point. You never know. Hmm. Too quiet for comfort. Sight. 
Last one! All clear! Did you get hit? I'm okay. Okay. Flight control tower. Heading there. Got a train to bring into the station. What now? I'll fire up the control panel. Bring the train in. What do you want me to do? Watch my comfort zone. Keep it clear. Of Meyer's minions. Sure. Let's do this. Good luck, Sung. Let me help. Lean on me. Got a train to catch. Fuck, that hurt hurts. It's gotta, I know. So me, but you killed it. Saved our asses. V. You hear that? It's the Black Hole. No fear, son. Right here with you. doesn't let up, does she? She's made her life about achieving goals. Turned herself into a kind of machine. Wow. 
you admire her. The pushing forth, never looking back, used to piss me off. Now, wish the future was all I could think about. Listen to the hum. Wish I could fall asleep, never to wake again. Hey, don't you doze off on me. Reed. I had a dream about him recently. I repeat. Same damn nightmare. About that same damn train. Him dying because of what I did. Could be Reed's having the same nightmares. I heard it all already from him. Hmm. <laughs> he put his trust in you for a time. Trust we then boldly betrayed. History. Water under the bridge. Not worth dwelling on. Hmm. I can't stop thinking about it. Creed forgave you. Song? Reed's not the only one I've betrayed. What do you mean, Song? Neural Matrix. Only be used once. Once? How so? It's a captive AI from beyond the wall. Relies on continuous evolution to exist. I'll free it and end the process. It'll then execute my commands and disintegrate irretrievably. What about me? Not obvious. You'll fight on. Keep looking. You're stronger than I am, V. Stronger than anyone else I know. You fucking serious? I... I think... I think... I'm gonna die soon. I regret. I wasn't honest with you. I'm sorry. Could have told me the truth. Would have helped you anyway. Song? I did he fuck. Color me impressed. Bird took everyone for a ride. Myers, Hanson, Reed, you. Having some fun with me, are you? No, I'm fucking serious. Takes character to be a bastard front to back and inside out. Believe me, I know. Woman's obsessed, determined to a fault. That earns my respect. Fuck all that. Thing is, you and me are back at square one. Still have that problem. Find it some way to save ourselves. Could always call Reed on the hollow. <laughs> Think he'd kill me. Damn, globe-sized ego, V. You mean Zilch to him. One, just one person he's gunning for. Well, nice to drop in and shoot some shit, V. High time you woke him. Almost there. 
clearly need some help. Nearly there. Ends in sight. Fucking hell. Stop there. Don't come any closer. Move an inch and I'll kill you, V. I will. Fuck off. For all time. Final warning. Look. Look. Put near down. Go now. So, what do you want to do? You're not taking her anywhere. Spare me the quote straight out of Bushido 10. Look at her, V. Be serious. You want to send her to the moon? Our neurosurgeons are her only chance. Back on the roof, Myers ordered her killed. You didn't protest. You heard it. Every last word. The situation's changed. Just leave Songbird to me. I can still help her. You'll take her over my dead body. If she dies, she'll die a free woman. She wanted out and away. From you, Myers, the FIA, said so. Your past. You can't just escape it. I know what I'm talking about. How would you? Never tried it yourself. I'm just not naive, B. Gave me no choice. Fuck. Fuck, fuck. You had no choice. But your friend there will join Reed in the beyond if you don't hurry your ass. Get be okay. One last push. Bound for the moon, so me. Getting away from them all. Let's see, what do we got here? Life support activated. Diagnostics. Pressure O2, infusion all pump. Get that feeling too sometimes. Four Drop everything, leave it all behind. Wouldn't it be nice? Oh. Gently now. Good luck, son. In spite of it all. Patch locked and sealed. Internal power activated. Hydrogen pressure sufficient for takeoff. Automatic boot sequence initiated. Well, no turning back now. Minus 60 seconds. RS-25, main engine ignition. Here we go. First time I've ever launched a spacecraft. You? Same, man. Same. T-minus 50 seconds. Solid propellant engines burning. Spark Whatever awaits me in orbit. Hope she ends up happy. She's free. Slammed at home. She has just a bit of what I lacked entirely. Fucking luck. Song had a goal. Was ready to pay profusely for it. And she did just that. Think I paid no price? They killed you because you wanted them to. Your only way to be a hero was to be a dead one. Huh. Guess I could have done more. Been different. Maybe. Could also be I was convinced I couldn't make it out alive. And maybe, just maybe that chick had great follow through to the fucking end. And I lacked that last ounce of determination. Duh. Well, 
At least you're being honest with yourself. That in itself's some version of freedom. What do you say next? Be all you could be? Limitations are all in my head? Just watch the show, Johnny. T-Zero, lift me. from here now we wave bye-bye to your dreams of living a long happy life got the two of us some more time together fuck me oh joy and things ain't all bad at any rate politicos and spies at war us in the middle we came out whole. Sure, shit made some enemies, powerful ones, too. Myers will remember. Won't let it pass. No fucking way after you killed the most loyal of her hounds. Giving her too much credit, Johnny. Myers sacrificed Saul once already, set him up. At least this time, he decided how he'd die. Yeah, on his own terms. Best sunset to life he could hope for. Best any of us can, actually. Miles better living with the knowledge you shredded and trounced your ideals. Need to shift focus now. To myself. My own path. I'll say. Fucking with NUSA plans launching a half-dead cyborg into orbit. Adds bricks to that edifice called legend. But clock's ticking, friend. You're dying. Gotta do something about it. 